All right. Well, we are back. We're back at the Nine Club Experience, everybody. Episode... 28. <laughs> 28. Thank you, Steezus. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that was Raj. Last episode, Steezus answered in for him. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> So, we got a good show lined up for you guys today. Good show. Uh, we got... We got a really good show. Really? <laughs> really good. Really good. Okay, Raj. Right. That was, uh, <laughs> yeah. I know what that... I know what that's from, actually. That's from... Um, don't tell me, Raj. Don't tell me. That's... Uh, who's the guy that used to wear the, the, the bean... Ocean Howl. Ocean Howl's part in... Um, what video was that? It's probably a bird. No, no. One it, it had to be in a birdhouse video, right? Was it a birdhouse video? It was, yeah. Yeah. Because <laughs> today like we got Chris... a really big show. A uh, really big show. Remember that video? I don't remember. You don't that remember? One. No. Jesus. No. That one. No. It was no. in the end. Because that Ocean Howe was in the end. It was Ravers. Oh uh, yeah. I, think, I don't know. I think that jersey's sucking the life out of Steezus' hey. <laughs> memory. It's a little young. But we're, making, <laughs> we're making do with what we got. You okay, okay. I thought he was wearing body paint. <laughs> <laughs> How amazing! Steve says body paint on. <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> oh man! Yo, Raj is on one tonight. I can already feel oh, it. Oh, okay. He it's looks calm, good. but he's, he's yeah. about to fire it off. It's dude. something different well, in like his vibe it. right now. I like now. it, man. Well, listen, man. This this past week has been great, Raj. We got uh, we're on Spotify now, huh? Oh, we're yeah. on Spotify, everybody. It's about damn time. It's about time. Listen, it's it's hard to get on Spotify, but the, you know we we had to switch up our RSS feed for you people who don't know what that is. It's uh, the the feed that um, populates our, uh, our, our RSS our, our, our RSS is <laughs> <it's, it's, laughs> no, it it, it populates our uh, podcast feed and everything. So if anybody has any trouble uh, downloading episodes just keep trying or I don't know what to, I don't know what to tell you but, just keep trying uh, yeah keep trying no it should be okay though should be okay How if, you have, if you have any trouble uh, you know just refresh your feed or whatever we're, we're, we're in the process of switching things up how did know? that happen did you like submit to try to be on Spotify or y a while ago yeah a while ago and uh, yeah we're just switching things up a little Spotify action and uh, cool. in order to be on Spotify we had to switch uh, switch companies that we were using everything for, oh. our, for our podcast Damn. audio version and it's, uh, it's working out you know we're slowly but surely we're figuring this damn thing out eldridge i like it <laughs> you know but uh oh speaking of well, listen we had uh we had malto on the show monday you know great episode yeah. malto's hilarious yeah. great dude great stories i'm surprised you finally tracked him down he's top three hardest dudes he is yeah. really yeah. he is i texted him after the show he didn't respond to me even, <laughs> even after he was on the show he didn't respond that that, yeah. that sounds pretty accurate right yeah. right but it was a great he had some great stories to tell raj he, he told uh, a lot of funny shit it was great great episode but there was one story in particular that i i have to get to the bottom of before we start the show it involves our boy eldridge here eldridge uh, malto was talking about a, a certain tour that you guys went to kansas city uh it was the first time kind of sean he was a little kid he first time he's met everybody and uh eldridge you know they were they were they eldridge and 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 jeremy rogers were looking for a party to go to and they were like oh yeah we, we, there's a party going on you know and then uh, all of a sudden they're at the party at a house party at a house party yep. and eldridge and jeremy are being chased by the cops are being chased yeah <laughs> <laughs> no eldridge and jeremy pull up in a limousine, get out of the limousine, go up to the party, and actually Jeremy pulls a chick from the party. They get back in the limousine and go to the hotel. Don't forget they were wearing chains and oh, cologne. Oh, yeah, chains and cologne and all I this stuff. I was not wearing chains. Well, well we're gonna, <laughs> I was not wearing well, I wanna chains. I want to get to the bottom of this. And then you get back to the hotel, and by the time Malto got to the hotel, everybody was gone and Kenny's iPod was missing. Somebody stole Kenny's iPod from the, from the room. Any of this ringing a bell? I remember the limo. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I remember the, yeah, going to the house party. I remember going to the house party. Yeah. Who's that deal with the limo? I, dude, I, I, that part, I don't remember. No? I do not remember it how. It had to have been Jeremy. Oh, for sure. Yeah. For sure. For sure. I mean, you don't, you weren't wearing chains and stuff. I could, I could imagine you like asking Jeremy for like uh, extra oh. chains to wear. Possibly, maybe. Yeah. Like I think maybe we were just doing it to, but I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I do remember that though, and I totally forgot about that. Yeah, he said you guys showed up like rock stars. Why was he not there? He wasn't there with us in the limo. No, Ma, this was when he was first like he was, was on like flow. 14 14 or something. Something. Yeah, he was young. Amazing. He was in the party drinking like Capri Suns. Yeah, and orange slices after the demo. <laughs> Amazing. I do remember that, but I don't remember how that happened no? at all. No, no, don't know recollection. Nah. No, nobody. You don't know who stole Kenny's iPod because we're we're, we're okay. So you know, you know, it's another part of that I do remember. And I don't know if this is probably the best like, this part of the story, but <laughs> we did bring a bunch of people back into the room. The hotel, right. Yeah, and I think I was rooming with, I was rooming with Kenny at the time. Mm -hmm. And it was just me, Jeremy, and like a bunch of girls or whatever. And I remember looking over at Jeremy, like he was talking to this chick and he was like, you want to, you want to see my dick? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to see my dick? Dude. This girl said, yep. They went in the bathroom, didn't come out for like fucking a no while. Way. Yeah, really? like, so that's how you do it? So you kind of were in charge of the room at that point. And then Kenny's iPod. I do remember feeling fucking horrible for that. Oh, dude. really? So yeah. you do remember his iPod? I do remember yeah. that. Yeah, right. yeah. Oh, he wow. was so bummed. Well, like, uh, we, we think that he had like his first shoe designs on there <laughs> and like everything. So he was trying to look Yeah, forward. sorry, Kenny. I don't fuck. Yeah. yeah. Jeremy. 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 Okay. He's not here, so blame Jeremy. Right? I can just imagine, though, when they ordered the limo, that he was, Justin was so hyped oh, yeah. that idea. Oh, for <laughs> sure. For sure. <laughs> for sure. God. I don't remember how that happened, though, dude. I do not know how that happened. <laughs> uh, it's one of just one of the great stories that Malto was telling us. You That's know? a good I mean, story. We thought we'd ask you because you were there. No, nope. I do remember uh, Malto saying that uh, I was his favorite skateboarder growing up. No, that's not true. No. It's Eric Costin. Uh oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't remember too much shit from back then. <laughs> <laughs> nice try, though. Yeah. yeah. So um, whatever happened, I mean, we're, we're we're trying to get to the bottom of this. Nine Club investigates. Uh, the iPod. Yeah, I can't help you with that the one. Vanishing iPod. We're going to get to... Somebody in KC, Steezus, Someone knows... It. it probably was. It it's, sounds like it's one of the girls that stole it, yeah, huh? It's probably, probably one of them. Yeah, was. but there was probably dudes there, too. It wasn't just chicks. It was, yeah, like, like, it was how, a party like, at the hotel. All the fucking dudes that were probably at the demo that wanted to like hang out at yeah. that time probably came back. Yeah. The funny story is, though, I'm not going to say any names because, you know, whatever, but... The chick who sucked off Jeremy in that bathroom was like one of the homies' girlfriends. You so oh, know nice. about this? Yeah. Amazing. Of course, it was That's probably City, a big, it was so. probably a big deal when that happened. Huh? It was, like everybody was talking about it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't believe it. Like yeah. I could not believe it. I was like, "Wow, that's easy. That's guess that's how you do it." Wow. <laughs> you want to see my dick? Yep. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <Later>. <laughs> like goddamn. So, but yeah, we got a great show lined up. We got a bunch of news topics to talk about. Skateboarding videos. Uh, we're actually going to take some calls. We haven't done that in like months. No way, Raj. We haven't taken a couple calls. Yeah. So Gonna, we haven't had any good calls. Where, well, oh, Rick said know. he was going to call in, dude, if we had a, a I Yeah, call. right. I swear, he's like, when, when can I call in? Yeah, he uh, won't do it. I'll text him right now. He won't do it. Oh, Rick, that would be awesome. Rick Howard. Uh, but yeah, we got a, a, a bunch of good stuff, man. But, uh, videos, uh, callers, uh, all kinds of stuff. Rush, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Maybe a drunken stone. Drunken stone. Oh, we haven't done one of those. We've, we've, been been slacking, those. we've been slacking a long time on those. We've been slacking on a lot of things. I know. It's hard work, man. It's fucking only me and Raj over here. Yeah. You know what I mean? None of us. Yeah. There's nobody else here. Yeah, nobody, nobody else. Nobody, nobody else. else. Well, you guys just come in and do the show. Ha ha. Happy, happy, happy. And then you leave and we got to do all the work. That was Yo, a really good impression of us. That was, that was, yeah. that was pretty spot on. That was good. That but was good. Just like all three have, of us. I will have to say, Roberts, I've told you more times than I can count that I am down to help and bug me. Let me know. Bother what, me. What can you do? And how many times have you hit me up? What can, zero. Exactly. <laughs> but what, so it's what, not for lack of trying. It's but not, wait, yeah, what can you do? What can, you've seen what my can fucking you Instagram edits that I make of myself. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's true. true. That's, That's true. true. Yeah. <laughs> like, I made this rad Instagram. It's all him. <laughs> but uh, but what about uh, anything else? Like, um, I don't, what do we need help with? Well, so you got to put the things on the table and with? let me pick what I can do and what I can help with. Okay. Okay. We'll make a list. We'll make a list, Raj. Huh? Let's have a meeting twice. this week. We'll have a meeting. We'll have a nine club meeting and yeah. uh, we'll put Steezus to work. All right. Yeah. I'm down. I ain't scared okay. of no hard work. Maybe. That's I'm right. West player. That's right. You send some t shirts out or something. I could do that. You know, <laughs> you know Justin's not out. Uh, I know Justin's offering no help <laughs> whatsoever. He's, He's cool. sound like he got it. <laughs> Quietest I've heard him in a while. <laughs> 
So let's get into uh, let's get into it, huh, Raj? Sure. Should we'll we take some calls? calls first, or should we get into? Let's talk about some news quick. Well, let's talk about our first news topic, and then we'll get into some calls. What do you want to talk about? You want to talk about Vert? Oh, go ahead. Yeah, what do we, we got? Vert. A couple good Vert parts. Oh, a couple good Vert parts. Yeah. Those, were they all kind of padless? I almost or some. Yeah, of, yeah. one of those. Clay was Clay was. Yeah, pad, yeah the madness part. He he was doing like backflips on the mega ramp with no pads, no helmets. Like yeah, was, that shit was scary. That made it look sketchy too. Yeah, like, the way they shot it, it made it look like there's like no deck on the right. Whoever filmed that too was like pretty nuts. Or was it him or dude. there's that line in the bowl in the rain? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah. was psycho because he the dude rolled in after him. I feel like people forget like oh, there's dude. a filmer fucking yeah. there like, when they're doing rolling that with shit. it. That's yeah. fucking nuts. Not that there's shit. only like a, a handful of like that dude. Chris Gregson kills it with that. He's so good. He's like one of the best. Yeah, he's yeah. incredible. Actually, skating too. But so I guess he could probably understand how to film it in there. Yeah. But Roger, you ever tried filming like that? Yeah, and then I uh, usually be like, hit him. Hey, hey, Rick, you want to try this? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, it was like they were, we were in uh, New Zealand on a. Um, a girl trip and there was this crazy snake run and I tried going through it and I was about to eat shit every fucking time and I had Rick actually film. I saw a video clip of, of Rick, fil- like someone filmed Rick filming the, the line, yeah. right? It was in the video, I think. Mm. But it looked like he did a good job. He killed it. What, are you scared, Rush? I mean, it's kind of hard to go through a fucking snake run with fucking oh. soft wheels on, mm. you know? You could borrow somebody's board. Sure, or I can just have a professional do it. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> a professional what? Professional skater or filmer? Skateboarder. I would rather get filmed by a professional filmer, to be honest. Sure. We <laughs> 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 have a professional Raj filmer that's a professional skater at the same give, time. Raj gives a camera away and is over there in the corner <laughs> drinking a champagne coolie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Having a cell in the corner. Nice. <laughs> Dude, whatever happened to fucking, uh, the, what was it called? The filming thing we were doing for a second? Robo Raj. Robo Raj. Oh, Robo Raj. Fuck Robo Raj. Yeah, yeah. What happened? Yeah. Oh, they came out with a couple updates, though, Raj. Maybe it's better oh, we'll now. Try we should try it. Yeah. 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 Anyways, back to the Vert stuff. Sure, go ahead. Sorry. <laughs> Jimmy Wilkins. Jimmy Wilkins. <laughs> that backside 360 crossbone thing he did? I was tripping on Ugh. the fucking bank, or the when he put the bench on top, it was in the back nose blunts and shit, like kick with back mm-hmm. smiths. Yeah, he was the straight street tricks. Yeah. yeah. The, yeah. Like, the yeah. sugar cane shove it. Dude, yeah. I, was one of, I mean, the, I hate to call it this, sometimes they call it the Vert button. You've yeah, heard they've heard that, yeah, but I didn't yeah. fast forward through those. Those were yeah. those were fucking the vert button, the dope button. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it was tight. You know, back <laughs> in the day, you ever heard you, that? I haven't heard that. VHS, you went before you could like skip parts and shit. You just hit the He's vert button. Vert one. button. <laughs> yeah. vert button. Yeah. I never heard of that one, dude. Yeah, when did we it, did oververt. We had the oververt button for Jimmy Carlin's part. Didn't uh, yeah, dude? Right. Wow. Didn't Carol like <laughs> edit out like Jordan Richter's part in the Plan B video? Who was telling oh, us blind that? Video, yeah. Oh, the blind oh, yeah. video. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like somebody was telling us that. Yeah, he, I think he did. Oh, was it him that told us? Oh no, who was telling? Someone went to Mike's house. Was it Sal Barbier? Maybe. I don't remember. We've done so many goddamn episodes. It's crazy. Yeah, it was, somebody said they went there and he took. Now, and then he saw it though too, right? Jordan Richter went like yeah. Jordan was there. Jordan yeah. was there and he yeah. took out his part in the right. video. Right, it was yeah. kind of he said, oh, uncomfortable, uncomfortable moment. Yeah. Yeah. Been Gavis. Yeah. <laughs> oh, maybe it was Gavin. It was. I think it was. Yeah. Gavin, okay. Yeah. Man, yeah. so many good little things on this show. Mm-hmm. You know, <laughs> it's a good show. People got to watch. But, it's a good show. Hey, yeah. There's like there's like a new generation of kids coming up on in like transition wise that are so f- incredible. Like those two for sure. And the uh, Corey Juno. Have you oh, guys seen sure. that dude? Yeah. That dude yeah. is. Fucked up, dude. Well, these kids live, they live at skate parks now. Dude. They're everywhere. No, it's its so fun to watch them, though, dude. Oh they, they can float. Like You watch them skate, you guys will trip the fuck out. Is yeah. Leandre is. L- Leandre so Sanders, nice. he's incredible. Dude, Jimmy Wilkins, though, he's got the best style on Tranny. He kills it, dude. He writes for Lakai, too, right? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Didn't they show, uh, <laughs> didn't Lakai, didn't Tony Hawk show his new Lakai shoe? Didn't he, uh, yeah, it was oh, like yeah. Airwalk. Airwalk, it right. It looks pretty yeah. sick. Right. Dude, Steezus, yeah. let's get a professional uh, shoe guy's opinion <laughs> on this. What a, I mean, it was still just a sample. Who knows if that'll be okay. the one that actually goes to production. But from what I saw, like just the little photos he posted, it looks pretty this dope. Cool. It looks cool. Yeah. yeah. The one yeah. with the white and the red. Yeah. It looks yeah. Like yeah. Old, yeah. Old Airwalk prototype. Yeah. 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 All these retro shits coming back, man. They, yeah. I can love this DC is going hard with that 90s retro. Yeah. A little too hard. Are they? <laughs> well, they haven't really released too much stuff, though. They only did the Lynx, the the Legacies, the Danny Way. The Boxer. No, it was the, um, 
It's syntax. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Mm. They should release the boxer though. That was the fucking. The syntax had the, the, uh, the strap in the back, right? And that has the toe cap around the front. The links, yeah. dude. The links. Links are yeah. So you can't tight. you can't ever hate on the links. Yeah, that's, no. that's okay, a fucking. That one's good. Yeah, that's a staple. I don't know. It just. It, Hey, props to all those dudes that are fucking skating around in those scenes because they look like cinder blocks. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't understand how you feel your board. Like, oh, buddy, that did that nollie flip nose manual on that, like, waist high ledge in, oh, was amazing. in DC, I think yeah. it was. Like, dude, like, how are you pulling your feet up that high when you got, <laughs> like, eight those pound cinder links. blocks on your feet? I actually just, like, tried a pair of those on mm-hmm. and they didn't feel like they would look. Like, I, you know what I mean? They, they, they look better than look. It, I'm sorry. Is that me? I mean, that yeah, felt yeah. better than the way they okay, looked. Like yeah, they yeah, didn't yeah. like yeah. Tiago had a pair, and I was like, "Yo, I just want to try it for old times' sake." Yeah, and I was like, "Oh, yeah, I feel pretty good." I mean, I can All skate right. the OG Excels too, and that's the same thing. True. I think yeah. I think if they brought the Hamiltons back, the audio Hamiltons, <laughs> I think those would oh, yes. go crazy. Which ones they might? Mm-hmm. Heard of those. Chris is the only one to skate those. You had the pleather ones. <laughs> yeah. They were good. Wait, did you have a did you have a colorway in that shoe? Is that what it was? No, no, no. It was a different shoe. Oh. A whole different shoe. I didn't realize at the time that the Hamiltons were so iconic. You know, I would have done a you Hamilton. You made them iconic. I know. <laughs> In 2018. <laughs> <laughs> Bring them back, Chris. No, the Hamilton was one that, ev- like, I won't say everybody, but a lot of people were running that. They were just the basic yeah. audio shoe. They yeah. were like the most basic. They didn't have a big A on the side of them. They were yeah. just really mellow. Had that so, Eugene soul. Little, little baby Was a. it? I don't know. They had that shoe that Eugene, and they had that same soul. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Ernie used to run those all the time when he was living in KC. Yeah, they were just, just mellow. Audios were crazy, Raj. You know? Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah they got super tech. <laughs> they they went for eight years. I know, <laughs> I know. But all the shoes back then were the same way. Yeah, everything was Like real. DBS was yeah. fucking bananas. Globe. You look, the Globe, D- S, DC. There's so many shoes mm-hmm. that were in their lines that were like like completely insane. They were just trying to get as tech as possible and compete with one another. And like, we got this for your fucking... Ollie control and all that, you know, like, dude. You know, I mean, but if you, th- if you think about it, it's skate shoes. So you making something that lasts back mm, then. Yeah. And they got smart and said, oh, we can make something that doesn't last. And they'll just keep buying and we it. we get more money. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Well, the funny thing is that the shoes back then were so thick mm. and they just like lasted longer. Yeah. Rice burner. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. Uh, no, but they, they were so thick. That sounds so stupid saying that they can last longer, but like, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, no, but you know, for a for real though, like shoes just literally lasted longer back then. Yeah, and that's now what I'm like, saying. Why yeah. are shoes fucking? I'll skate them for three days. I'm like, well, yeah. they're so much thinner. It's like I feel like it's half. Yeah, the but the shoe. style changes and yeah, everything right. too. Yeah. Exactly. It's like that's no, what it's, I was it's say. not just the shoe companies being like, oh, we could just make something thinner. No, exactly. It's it's really, it yeah. me like I want to be able to feel my board after skiing sure. cinder blocks yeah. so long. Yeah. Too. Oh my god! And the pants starting to slim down. Like yeah. that was the whole weird thing too. Is like people people's pants got skinnier, but the shoes were still just as fat for a minute. So mm-hmm. you kind of had to like everything had to taper in a little bit and slim yeah. down. Just like jerseys get a little. Th- Smaller, yeah. yeah. Know, uh, no, about it. no. <laughs> it's called Steez, player. You wouldn't know about it. That uh, young medium. St- <laughs> <laughs> I got Steez, Steezus. Okay. You don't know. You don't know. We should go bro. shopping together one day, dude. Wow. That would be amazing. That's a great episode. Where would we go? Amazing. I mean, we got a few. TJ I got Max. A few be- Let's go to Fairfax. <laughs> you you guys, he looks at me like I'm nuts. <laughs> No, you guys should go to Fairfax. We can go, go to He doesn't go to TJ Fairfax, Max. dude. You know, not anymore. Okay. I'm a little outdated for right. that. Steve so just gets to dress Chris and whatever yeah, he wants. Chris yeah, Chris gets to dress. Yeah, yo, I am so down for That'd that. That'd be amazing. Oh, wow. Where would we go if we had to go shopping? If you um, we can the go store some, of your choice. Yeah, we can go to Melrose. I got some homies that have a shop called Bait. We can hit okay. that up. We might need to go uh, hit a couple sneaker shops. Make sure we get your feet right too. I can throw you in a couple fitted. So yeah, we'll hit like we can hit that like that Melrose Fairfax intersection. Okay. We can yeah. go to like Cool Kicks or you know go to the Flight Club or something like that. Like oh fight oh okay we'll get you right. Did you say Fight huh? Club Flight 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 FL. He said he said Fight Club. Uh, we don't, I don't know what the hell he's talking about. <laughs> Where would That's you the first me? rule about Fight Club. Yeah. <laughs> where, where would we go if you wanted to dress me? If go. you want, if we wanted, it, uh, we'd go down to Chocolate and we'd get some <laughs> free shit, <laughs> and we'd got call up like uh, Adidas, get some shoes for you. I'm definitely we, with that. <laughs> You were just talking about Flight Club and all this stuff. Like I like I don't wear like the dope. Like I don't have fly shoes. Look at these fucking Rodrigo TXs I'm wearing right now. Yeah, you know what. You're absolutely right. Are you? I'm not gonna hate on the homie wherever you go. You're definitely yeah. doing from from the ankle down. You're crushing it. Oh god, the, the ankle, ankle down. down. <laughs> My socks oh. probably, probably aren't even that good. It's all what good. Socks do I have right now? Oh my god. Stance. <laughs> oh, yeah. Stance. So from the chin down, you're crushing it. <laughs> from, from the chin down. 
I mean, I don't shin, know. shin, shin, definitely, oh, definitely shin. not, not, no, 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 no. Whoa. You know, you learn something new. You think you're doing things right, and then all of a sudden, like, you need to just hurry up and have some kids because you got the skate dad, like, down. Wow. Down. Skate dad? You need to have kids. <laughs> the guy's, that was a good one. The guy's going, like, the guy's going kayaking and, like, Dude, all he the, the most night thing. golf. Yeah. And, like, the oh, glow in the door, the glow in the dark. Night golf. The shit that comes out of your mouth sometimes, <laughs> I've I've never heard anybody utter, no the, phrases, utter those words. Yeah, no phrases anybody else would ever you say. Dude, last, be joking. Yo, dude. yesterday I went kayak fishing. Ocean fishing. Ocean fishing. <laughs> I did. And then like five minutes later, you're like, oh, that night we went night golfing. <laughs> Glow in the dark night. It was you know, you he's know. out of his mind. Try to live out here. You looked a little sunburned today. Fucking burnt. Wait, <laughs> hey, PSA or whatever the fuck. Wear fucking suntan lotion. Thanks, Aldridge. You're yeah. welcome. <laughs> Let's I move this. I, I don't think I've ever put suntan lotion on in my life. Let's yes. take some calls. <laughs> let's, let's move. Let's move this along. Well, huh? hey, we're let's talking go. about we're talking about DC stuff. Uh, they released their new little street sweeper. Mm. Yeah, it was like a 17 minute long video, I think, or yeah, something. 18. Yeah, it was pretty sick. What'd you guys think? I mean, it was Buck. Like I said, it was Buck seeing all those dudes skate in those gnarly shoes, yeah. like trying to go ham. But then it was also like a shift where you had, um, uh, what's old buddy's name? The dude from Philly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Gardner. The is he like Josh the, the mini Kalis? Yeah, Kalis. Uh, oh, yeah. John Shanahan. Shanahan. Hey, you know what yeah. though? This I don't know if it sounds weird or not, but I fully when I watched that I was like, he looks like Jack Curtin from like two thousand four. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, like, I felt that, that vibe from him. Because of the way he had like his swishy pants like yeah. pulled up and shit. I was like, yeah. oh shit, it's like Jack. That's the nice. beginning <laughs> of that video felt like I was watching like a Zoo York mixtape or something mm. like that from back in the day. It definitely it had, had like the whole like Zoo York mixtape feel in like a trans world like six cents yep. or something like that. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. No, it was sick though. I definitely ride with that. That's a long cool. video, Raj. For nowadays, yeah. Yeah. It was, a, it was a little weird, I thought, though. Oh, why? Yeah. Explain. Don't just say that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, next topic. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us why, Raj. Music selection was a little craze. You know what, though? Like, music nowadays in videos, it's all kind of craze. Yeah, I no. feel like. Yeah. It's, it, it's harder to get, and then they're just using, like, whatever they can get for, like, maybe free or oh, totally. cheap or yeah. something. It's it just, like, it ain't of, what it used to be. Some right. of the music choices just didn't seem on brand for DC. Mm-hmm. That's all. Hmm. Well, it was just a whole different genre. It was like he, you had the uh, dude in the middle, his name Gardner. Yeah. He, oh he, yeah, that was incredible. It, it was like Matt Field type vibe. Yep. On, you yeah. know. Mm-hmm. Yep. And then and then you had the throwback to uh, John Shanahan, and it was like these beats and everything like yeah. that. It was yeah. like drum and bass or whatever. Mm-hmm. And I was like, damn, this is a whole different scenario going on here. Yeah. Like, last part, Gardner's amazing. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, like for some reason, to me, like he doesn't fit DC. You know. He well, didn't fit that video. Oh, no. If it was an iPad that. video, it would have been perfect. <laughs> That's actually very true. But no, I think just the way it was, like you said, thrown in the middle, it was a little like, what's going on here? But Well, the, yeah. the, all the skateboarding was awesome, too. So mm. I'm like, oh, cheers. But then right. you, you watched a bunch of different videos at the same what time. I see, so it's, like, it's, 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 I know. Cheers. 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 Amazing. No, I think if they would have done, like, if they would have just kept it, like, the beginning and then Shanahan, but then, like, maybe put out a video with, like, Evan and Wes and t Oh, you're saying separate everything. Yeah, yeah, just because I feel like he fits more of that vibe and it wouldn't have been as a weird juxtaposition with that. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So I think he does fit DC, just he's not, like, in the van with those dudes. There's, like, two like. different, like... There's like two different squads. Yeah. Kind of, yeah. yeah. There's like the tech dudes and then there's like these leftover dudes from the previous people that were running in DC, yeah, I feel like, yeah. you know? And they all rip, dude. Oh, they all, they yeah. all fucking They're all kill good. Yeah. Hmm. yeah. You ever think they'll bring back VHS? No. Really? Why would they do no. that? I was kind of thinking like, you know, like record. Who, I, I was, who decides that? <laughs> well, uh, my thought. We're going pro- back to VHS, everyone. <laughs> no. My, Tosh- Toshiba's okay. like, okay. My, hey. <laughs> We've got a great idea here. Going Going back back circle. Zephyr. Yeah. No. Zephyr's like, whoa, we're in. Like, would it would it be like re- like record players type situation where it's like... Yeah, but nobody wants well, I go back. Well, there, but there are people like... Everybody's going backwards. That's what we're just talking about, the shoes. Yeah, no, but like... No, but there are, there are certain people that are like holding on to it for... An estate, like, secret tape is always yeah, like slinging, you, right. you know, right. VHS tapes yeah. on Instagram and shit, but I don't think but it'll be But those are originals. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't think it'll be a social shit. Sony's shift. not going to go make brand new VHS camcorders. Okay, so what I'm thinking Even too, like uh, the Polaroid stuff. Yeah. Polaroid, yeah, Fuji yeah. films and all that stuff too. So what I'm thinking too, though, is like, so 
it's cool nowadays you don't have you're not able to have it like you know a physical I mean? copy. Yeah, yeah you're not even you're yeah. not it's with skip. everything though I'm just saying. Yeah. I got a shit, but we got a shitload of VHSs here. I still the last one you po- too. Last time you popped. I haven't popped one right. in a long time. Yeah. Does it? It don't look different, right? It's horrible. It does. Yeah, it's horrible. I haven't you watched. You gotta one watch in it on like time. a tube, like television, yeah. in order to make it look good. But, but I do. I kind of understand where you're coming from because I could imagine maybe they do like one, like a company just makes like a VCR or whatever for like, like you were saying with the Polaroid some camera, some retro yeah, shit, yeah, yeah, some yeah. retro. But, but yeah. I don't think it'll. But it's ever not HD be though, like, though, is it? No, Standard no, no, depth. Yeah, but we be, have the GX yeah. fucking to your boys. Like they're doing it. Sure, you know, yeah. you never know. But they're 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 just dudes doing. They're not companies bringing shit back. Yeah, right. I mean, you know. quasi put. Their video on an, uh, VHS. Did they? They also put their video See what on I'm saying? Pornhub, which was fucking... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, yeah. but they weren't the first to do that, though. Yeah. What was the video that got re- Adi- released? Adidas. Adidas got a release. On Pornhub. On Pornhub, Adidas. yeah. Adidas. And, yeah. and I was, I was, I was asking, because I was like, that's a, mar- that's a great marketing genius. Right there. But genius. <laughs> Adidas didn't do that yeah. themselves, I did they? Someone doubt. on the inside probably did. I doubt. Okay, that's what Yeah, they're too big of a company to be like... Yeah, it was out before the video came out. Oh, okay. It was on there, and we're like, wow. Damn. I mean, whether Adidas did it or not, like genius. Yeah. Wait. Like, so wait, who's you're on there and you're like skateboarding? Yeah. <laughs> Somebody must because I was seeing it on people's Insta stories and I'm like, oh, this has got to be like a mock up or whatever. Right. Uh, and then I somebody did the swipe up that actually went to it. I was oh like, holy my. shit, this is real. <laughs> Bye, babe. Mm-hmm. <laughs> skateboarding. <laughs> Eldridge got his lotion out and <laughs> went and watched skateboarding on porno. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, watched it on there. Can I say something real quick? Yeah, go, no. ahead, go ahead, bro. So real quick. Seeing new Josh Kalos footage is fucking great. The, the, I thought it was funny. Like, they started with Josh and they ended with Shannon. Shanahan. Yeah. So it was like... It dude, was like uh, passing it to the torch on. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, John Shanahan fucked it up. He surprised yeah, the shit out of no, me. Yeah. Dude, the hippie jump, like, yeah. the board shoot, like through, the, like, through the needle thing? Yeah, no. He, 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 he skated the... Sh- yeah, he, he fucked it up. But he Kalis, that last part, yeah. Kalis, though, like just watching him skate and and mm-hmm. just being him. Yeah. He's always been him. He, and yeah. you know what I mean. He's yeah, never yeah, switched yeah. his shit. Like he's just been him, and that's like cheers to that dude. Because yeah. there, there it is again. Cheers. cheers. There it is again. <laughs> Wait, did I say cheers before? Or yeah, you yeah. said cheers. I'll fucking say cheers again. Damn, cheers, <laughs> Kelly. <laughs> Hey, is that Josh Kalis's little girl that I always like the, in the little in low the rider shit? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah shit. drifting and shit. Yeah, Crazy. that's insane. Wasn't it Layla, Crazy. I think it is. Layla yeah, Kalis or something. something yeah. yeah. Hey, I tried to get uh, Kelly to do a hippie jump the other day. Oh, what happened? Um, not really. Not really. I said, Kelly, do a, do a hippie jump right there. Over there. No. I was all, no. Nope. I guess, I guess, <laughs> nope. I literally said, like, guess who's not doing a hippie jump? Me. <laughs> That's literally what I said. He's Smallest so anti hippie. I know. I don't know. Why. It's just like a. It's just a trick. Yeah. It's not like it. It's not like people are gonna like, like the message boards are gonna light up. Oh like, I, no no no! I'm not worried about whatever anyone else is. I are don't you afraid care. of Simon? It's kind of like all these weird things. Where I'm just like, I don't care if I do that, and I just don't care. Uh, the only one that I've seen that I've ever liked, or there's only been two really. The one Tom Penny did, where he did the 360. Oh, yeah, video radio. That was fucking yep. incredible. And then Alex Olsen, the one on Fairfax, is oh, yeah. fucking insane. But, but it, it, what about the one Gons did in that Adidas 2050 video? Dude. Oh, dude, that was. That was fucked up. Yeah, yeah, no. For a 50 year old? For a 50 year old and him anyone. doing it over like a bump to bar where the board has oh, to yeah. drop down and like. Gnarly. And we're getting kicked out of the time. Dude. Oh, yeah, you filmed the whole thing, right? Or Me and Mullern, yeah. yeah. That was an awesome video. Dude, that was such a good video. Like, it just felt good to watch. That you 2 know? million views. Dude, and climbing. Mm-hmm. It was one of those things where, like, it crossed from, like, day in the life slash vlog style to, like, skating and just, like, person out. Like, all this shit mixed. Me- sh- <sighs> Got it. You got it. You got it. All this what? <laughs> All this shit like meshed together and like mixed into one because you got like Gons who's a legend. And he's just like this goofy, carefree dude, and then Tyshawn who's like the new Steezy, like New York wave. Like he's all about it. But those two worlds coming together was mm, such a beautiful fucking thing, like, dude. It was so oh, yeah. people just love the Gons. Whatever is, something exactly. comes out with the Gons, or people are gonna just eat that dude, shit. The up. girl yeah. that got all psyched to them. Yeah, they, that, was, that was pretty tight. That was like yeah. stopping yeah. while he's like. <laughs> Rolling up and shit, kissed him on the head after she got a photo. That like, happens yeah. to me every day. I walk down yeah. Main Street here in Santa Monica. Damn, I'm gonna really? start walking with you. Oh my God. Switch, 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 yeah. Man, yeah. Oh, you don't even know, Steezus. Dude, <laughs> on Main Street, <laughs> where 
go. You, the line where you did the fucking uh, Welcome to Hell. That's right. This, I go sit on that ah, ledge all the time yeah. and go just wait for, wait for people. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, you need to move. Sometimes I set up a, a card table and do autograph signings Ooh, down there. That's smart. He's here. He's, 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 he's here. I, I, I'm just this lone dude sitting there. People are like, what the fuck is That'd this That'd actually be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> actually like, what is he doing? Magic pop tricks up, or some shit? Pop up autograph yeah. signings. The ledge, the, the ledge is still there, but it's knobbed. Um, and on a random note too, or two big things happened, uh, skateboarding and baseball wise, you see Tony Trujillo threw out the fucking first pitch no. yesterday. Oh. Yeah. That was fucking, and he actually threw a good pitch. It was like, mm-hmm. <laughs> like it was tight. And then uh, did Paul, it looks like Paul threw one out too. He's that was done that old, before. That was yeah. an older that was photo. A, yeah, that he was, was, he did that like last summer actually. Oh, okay. Yeah, I saw but that. he did throw a first pitch at the Dodgers game last yeah. year. For, oh, okay. Like Nike set that all up. It's got to be nerve wracking. I was going to say, dude, like <laughs> either you do it and you, you get it right and nobody really was going to care about it or right. you fuck up royally yeah. and you're going to be talked about for right. fucking dude, years. The one Snoop did was so bad, but it was like, yeah, <laughs> it became a full meme. Just That's like, what I'm saying. Like the uh, Baba Booey on uh, oh, yeah, Howard, Howard like, Stern. Yeah. Horrible. Yeah. They still talk about it to this day. It's Probably a better thing to do is blow it. Fuck it up. Yeah, but then you're yeah. that dude. Yeah. Right. You can't be that dude. Who was I was hearing someone talk about today and they were like, Yeah, fifty cent through one that was like really bad one. Probably too. so. I believe it. And I was like, yeah. Oh, yeah. See the bad ones. Nobody remembers Nobody the good remembers ones. Nobody remembers the good ones. Yeah. 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 Like, oh, just another fucking pitch. Just all another right. pitch. Let's make this episode terrible then. They don't remember all the words I spelled right. They just remembered about when I spelled wrong. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Let's take some calls, huh? Let's slow this down a little Let's bit. Do take some calls, huh? Let's see what's see Talk who to the people. Eric from Temecula, man. What's going on? You're on the Nine Club Experience. I had a question for Steezus. Oh, go ahead. Go oh, ahead. Good, wow. <laughs> I, I was wondering because I know he's big on sneakers. I was wondering if he could. What's his favorite Jordan, and why is that his favorite Jordan? My favorite Jordan of all time is the Air Jordan 11 Concord. It's a very cliche answer, but I'll tell you why. I remember being in fifth grade, and it was the first time that I had ever seen patent leather in my life. And I didn't know what the fuck it was, why it was so shiny, and why it was so beautiful, but I knew I had to have it. <laughs> like, Give me that. Give you me get, that. You got it, so you got a pair. Um, I didn't get a pair when I was younger, but when I talked about this in my footnotes that I did with the barracks, mm-hmm. I, uh, when they came around, I think it was 2011, I believe, when they re-retroed them, uh, I, uh, I got three pairs. So you don't own the originals? No, not the OGs. No. I was in fifth grade at the time. What too, are those so worth? Like, uh, Do you have a con- pair of the OG, original, whatever you were talking about? The old <laughs> <laughs> Concords? Yeah. Air Jordan and Concord. <laughs> sure. Um, OG uh, Concords, I don't know if they're really worth much. Most of hmm. them are like crumbled now. I don't oh, think you okay. can really find... I'm sure there are a few pairs out there that are still intact, but... When you go back to the 90s, the, the glues that were used and shit like uh, that, it doesn't hold up over time. So right, right. the shoes just crumble. You it's literally can't right. wear them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Um, but yeah, the uh, Air Jordan 11 Concord was, is definitely my my top Jordan. There you go, Eric. What's your cho- oh. uh, What's your top Jordan? Thanks, guys. Eric? I like the the, the um, Black Cement Jordan 3. It's my favorite Jordan nice. of all time. Damn. That's a good one, too. That's a real good one. That, one's, that one gets skated a lot. Yeah. Mm. A lot of people skate this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see that a lot too. <laughs> yeah. All right, man. Well, thanks. You. Comfortable. Th- thanks for calling, Eric. Fuck yeah, Eric. Have a good one. Yeah, bro. no problem, guys. Have a good night. Okay, you too, bro. Later, Is dude. that the one that looks like the Paul? The Paul did the yep. one. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Let's get another call in the line here. Maybe it's another. Maybe we can now talk have... a, talk about shoes. <laughs> 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 hey, Holden from Vermont, man. Welcome to the Nine Club Experience. So you got a, a topic or a, a question you want to t- ask or talk about? Yeah, um, my local skate shop's closing uh, at the end of the month. Yeah. Which kind of sucks, but was wondering, like, what do you guys think about, like, how you could kind of, like, what skate shops could be doing, it's or, a, like, how do you see the value of skate it's shops? It's an age-old question, currently? Olden, man. It's an age-old question. Yeah, I feel like that's an age-old one. But at the end of the day, you just need to get people in there buying your shit. It's tough with online shit, man. Yeah. It's fucking yeah. tough, dude. There's everything everywhere. Everyone Every- can buy something everywhere. It's, yeah. it's But see, that's the thing though. It's like yeah, e-com has taken over as far as like selling, you know, product, but 
it's all about having a shop that has a good sense of community. Yeah, no, yeah. if you're a brick and mortar, you need to be bringing people in for one hundred percent. Like you Events, look at like classic looking, in Reno, you know, mm -hmm. shops like that where they really take the community into their own hands and they really rally around what's going on within that city and that skate scene, and you know, bring people in or do community uh, based events. Like, like they make uh, people want to go shop. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. you have to yeah. build up a rapport with Heck your yeah. with your uh, your audience or your consumers and make them feel like they're a part of it. It'd be cool to customers. For true, yes, for please. sure, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Shout out to Home Base and, and PA; they do a great job with that too. Mm -hmm. A lot of good skate shops. There's a lot. All the shops have been lot. around for a while. They're they've been doing that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, look just, at Escapist back in Kansas City. Yeah. You know, oh, yeah. those dudes are keeping it running too. Bringing yeah. still to this day, bringing you know demos through the town throughout the summer and and just doing different things. Like I said, community based events, making sure that people feel like they're a part of the scene. And and I think that's how a skate shop can thrive and can stay alive. Because it's not all based on like what you're selling, what products are moving and all that. But if you have a community that, you know, fucks with you, they're going to want, <clears throat> excuse me, they're going to want to spend their money with you as opposed to going online and, you know, yeah, totally. doing it that way. Yeah. It's like being in this situation, like knowing the owners and we just did like a big like session. Uh, it's also a skate park too. So like, we got to like skate super late and like had a bunch of people travel up from like a couple states away and like come back for it. And they've been doing it for 16 years and now it's, I'm just wondering, like, kind of how is going forward where obviously you can get everything online and it's so easy and you're like, oh, there's this obscure company that I'm into, like, how do, like, how does a skate shop compete where it's like, you can essentially shop your way through Instagram. Well, does your skate shop, you guys obviously, does your skate shop, like, do, do you know why they're going out of business? Have you talked to them? Yeah. Um, I think it's just like with the lease and being able to compete with it. It just well, didn't true. work out. That's true. So. Yeah. I and mean, they can always just move into locations yeah. and if it's just a, the lease thing, you know? But a lot yeah, of these skate shops too sure. have online too, though, you know? Oh, but, yeah. but, but I guess there's like so yeah. many skate shops with so yeah. many online things. It's like, how do you like get up in the Google search and shit, right? Mm -hmm. If you're looking for like an Eric Costin board. I mean, I'm sorry, you Chris did, Roberts board. Have that <laughs> how are you going to find it? You know, what's, what's, I wonder what the top search is for Chris Roberts board. I wonder where that comes up. Probably the nine club. Holden, you got your computer there? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Google Chris uh, Chris Roberts uh, skateboard. See what, what's the first link that comes up there? Guarantee it's the crop. You think? For well, sure. I mean, but but the but where to buy it though? Oh, oh, oh where yeah. to buy it? Probably girls skate. We're doing a chocolate blind Google search. Chris, where do I? Do we do Chris Roberts chocolate board. Sure, sure. I'd do Chris Roberts model. Or maybe uh, you know, <laughs> maybe an eBay or will come up. This yeah, is worth probably a lot of money now. Oh, the eBay more the beard. The original, sure. yeah, things sure. going for thousands of dollars. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> wow, yeah, sitting on a gold mine over here. You need to start the seeing. top hit is go ahead. Your setup from Ally Skateboard. No, 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 hold on. We need the, the skate. And Justin no, we need to, uh, to buy the board. <laughs> Excuse me, shopping. where the yeah, to shop. Where's this? What, what, what's coming up first to shop? What was the Ooh, for shopping results? There you go. What do we you do? have? Your um, I think the Dart series that was called. It's a, that's um, a, that's eBay probably eBay then. For yeah. 300. Oh, that's pretty good. Damn. But is any shops coming up? Like, Whoa, where, like dude, this is two. Yes, yeah, it's three hundred bucks. That's pretty nice. He's surprised. Yeah, three hundred bucks for your board. <laughs> He's surprised. But any shops coming up? <laughs> uh, see, that's what I'm saying. How are the shops? No, so that's that's a good like, point. Yeah. How do shops do that? How do shops get into Google search? They have to pay. You have to pay, right? To I get don't in. No, you have to have somebody know that knows yeah. their shit. I think it's all about like how you do the tagging and all the data and stuff. Yeah, that's that's what I'm saying, though, man. Where, how are these but, shops supposed to sell online if, if my board's not popping up on their search <laughs> results? <laughs> Yo, you don't even want. I, so I typed in, where can I buy a Chris Roberts skateboard? Mm -hmm. The first one. The longboardstore.com. There you Perfect. go. There you go. Click, so, hey, click on that see, link, uh, Steezus. I don't want to say it. <laughs> hey, click on that <laughs> link, Steezus. See what board they got on there in the longboard shop. It's the. Uh, it's the one. It's not this one. The one behind you that goes with the. Uh, oh, the series one. The series, yeah. Oh, how much is that going for over there? <laughs> it's been marked down from fifty-five dollars to forty-two. Damn. <laughs> Even with the online marketing that the longboard but shop has, the side, <laughs> they're still marking shit down. <laughs> First fucking hit. God damn it, Holden. 
the first hit's one for thir- like forty bucks, and then the next one's on eBay for like three hundred. So you know what I mean? Pretty dude? wild. They don't fucking like about that. somebody go buy that board because it's worth money. <laughs> 300 for the dark How deck? the hell? Yeah, that's gnarly. What's that about, dude? Is it signed? I don't think no, so. It looks nah. like it's in the wrapping still. They tag Supreme, though, so maybe that's probably... Oh, that's... maybe, yeah. Anyway, Holden, we got to move the show along, bro. <laughs> we, you know, we can't... We, we yeah, could talk about this all, all episode, but we really can't. But hey, man, thanks for calling in, man. Hopefully your well, skate shop can, uh, you know, I don't know, man. It's a, it's a, it, like I said, it's the age old question, right? I location. mean, Steezus has his point of view. Roger says, go find a new location. Um, you know, Yo, I don't know. I, and honestly, not even trying to be funny. Like you, maybe you guys can start up a GoFundMe, you know, to, and connect with the, like I said, connect with the community, the city of skaters there and like, see if there's anything you can do to help the shop thrive because at the end of the day, if the shop doesn't have people coming to shop there, they're not going to be able to stay in business. But it, it doesn't fall on the community. It falls on them to make sure that they're making everybody feel included in what's going on. Yeah. But maybe you can talk to the owners and see if there's like, you know, a last ditch effort. Like, fucking throw a, a car wash in the city or whatever to save the shop something, or like, you know, like, yeah. I'm sure there's something that can be done. You know, That's like, right. yeah. there's little community events or just don't be afraid to like get creative and try different things to, to keep hope alive and, you know, see if something can come of it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. For real. But dude, like, retail is this hard everywhere. Like in yep. not even just in skateboarding, just in the world right now. Which yeah, is crazy. Oh yeah. Charm Charm yeah. Like, what? The fucking ribs man. That shop. No, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Fucking humongous. So that much shit. Insane. Yeah, but yeah. they're like their community there is so strong. Right. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like they're all they're all like in there together. There's probably so many factors that factor in right. the totally. shop. Yeah. You know, Hit the, or miss. The, the, the number of skaters there. There's yeah. I mean, it's probably endless. The town that know? it's the in. The town, everything. Yeah. Yeah. You know? <laughs> no, but hey, seriously, Holden, we gotta Appreciate we gotta move it. this along, man. Thank you so much for calling in. And uh, good luck to you out there, man. For yeah, real. thanks, guys. Have a good one. All, All right, right, G. Too, bro. Later. Yeah, enjoy Peace. the rest of your night. Thank you, bro. Hey, Steve, do you think um, if someone took the Flight Club like uh, model mm-hmm. and made it a skate shop, you think it would work? Where you bring in like old decks? I do, actually, style? because it would be, exactly, it would be consignment. So it's like, if you, t- you have something that, like I had a bunch of boards, they got stolen, unfortunately, out of my apartment, but... I had a bunch of old boards I had been collecting over the last like 20 something years. And yeah. if I ever wanted to sell those, I would have to go the same route of like trying to do it on eBay. But if there was a consignment shop where it's like, yo, I got these or whatever, like I'm trying to like I mean, slain would, this. That would like, be dope. Dude, that, that would be for fucking old, incredible. For old shoes too, exactly. like all that yeah. shit. Yeah. Straight up. Like that's yeah, not But it a would bad work idea. in like LA. Oh, LA but it wouldn't work in like, well, you know, yeah, no. on the coast for yeah. sure. Right. LA and yeah, New York. That's maybe but, a pop up thing. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 But that's the thing too. Flight Club is only LA and New York. Right. Yeah. You know yeah, what right. I mean? So it's like in those the, those demos where it would work. I actually do think that would work. That's really pretty sick, dude. Because then you could do rad. like VHS tapes, DVDs. Everything. Like you could do all skate yeah. shit, you know? Well, you, all hard to find so stuff. All that right. Flight Club, I don't know much about that stuff, yeah. but it's not online at all. It is online. It is oh, online wow. as well. So the Dude, way the, it works. The amount like, of orders they do, like when, oh, it's I, insane. when I do a sneaker shop and whatever, and I'll show up to like go shoot there. The UPS driver will back his truck in, and they're like, they're loading that truck up. But it's yeah. shoes, though. It's not old skateboard, vintage skateboard. Yeah, but like they're but paying like fifteen thousand dollars for shoes. They ain't paying that for. But uh, think Chris about, Roberts dartboard. But, <laughs> but you know what though? If there was a because there was not a place. Exactly. If there was a place, you go and you're like, like oh right my now, god, remember eBay. that? But there's board, eBay like, though. Yeah, it's just eBay. There's all these like places. We're trying that, to brick and mortar. Yeah, some but shit. think about like Good eBay. Luck. There's all these different like you have to fucking navigate, and you don't know if the person is actually like if the board that they say is brand new has a chip on the top ply or whatever right. you know what i mean yeah. so it's like when you go to shops like this things are verified you have people that look at it and like yo we can sell this for this amount and they appraise it like i actually think that will work really well because then people too. that aren't in the you know on the coast or wherever that decides to pop up they can send their stuff into the consignment shop sort yeah. of like how so there's um um goat and StockX, which are two like sneaker resale apps, mm-hmm. and they have to verify that like if somebody sends a pair of fucking undefeated um, Jordan fours, sure, they send those in and they say, you know, these are dead stock, meaning they've never been worn, never been tried on. If they get them in, and they verify that that is true, then they can send them to the person that purchased them. Right. So if you did something like that, where they don't even have to have the physical product in stock, but they can show it online or show a way that these people can like go through a catalog of things. Like somebody might be looking for a red musket silhouette board and mm-hmm. somebody didn't properly tag it on eBay, they'll never find it. Right. But a site like this would actually work out well, so. 
Man, it seems like a lot of work. Robert, <laughs> Roberts hates hard work. Let's, uh, oh man, <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. Hello, who's this? You're on the Nine Club. Hey, how you doing? Oh, who's is this? this? Is this Chris Robertson? Is this Uncle Jesse? Who's this? <laughs> this is, no, this is, uncle, this is, uh, yeah, well, not your uncle. It's Ricky D from Unreal Skate Shop. Oh, Ricky Over D. Here in Somerville, New, yes, uh, Somerville, New Jersey. Oh, okay. You ever, uh, you ever this, see, uh, this, I'm this. calling about, uh, my, I'm, I'm calling about my Crimson Skateboard Stacks. Order. I had to put in an order for those a while back. I still haven't received those. Uh, you, you're calling the wrong place, man. We we don't <laughs> know. Markovich. Yeah. <laughs> I thought this was CCS Magazine. I have an account with those guys. We have we stocked the shop up with uh, Grind King trucks, and uh, I got crimson boards. I got a few left. If you guys want to come in? You got any uh, Roberts boards in there? Uh, some of them were going for three hundred bucks on eBay. I'm over here at the supermarket with my nephew. We're getting a couple of pounds of chicken for the house over here. Oh, <laughs> uh, boneless or uh, boned? Boned in? We're doing uh, no, we're doing uh, boneless breast. With, boneless uh, red meat. Boneless bread. Red meat. <laughs> No, with, with the rib meat on there. Oh, Ooh. rib meat. Okay. And do you season yeah, them with anything go in particular? Uh, to, uh, some type? I, I like to lather them up with mayonnaise before <laughs> I uh, bread them and then uh, I put them in, a, in, the, uh, in the oven. And Ste- I, is that a Kansas I City cook thing? Them up real good. Fuck no. No? <laughs> is it not? Uh, I don't want the nice nah. chicken. <laughs> Where are you shopping there, uh, Jess? Uncle, D- what is your fucking name again? Ricky D. Ricky D. Ricky D. Ricky D. Where yeah, you? Are you got uh, a Costco out? What? What? What do they well, got out there? Well, I'm at Walmart right now. I get everything over here. I get my chicken over here. My stuff for my car batteries and my uh, <laughs> uh, ointment. My uh, I got Preparation H over here. They got it in a good good sized tub of that. You can get it real cheap. Yeah, uh, anyways, it's it's fun, man. You come down to the shop. We, we want to do a demo with you guys. Maybe we'll get uh, the one guy, uh, what's his name, the, the blue Rajan? Roger, uh, Roger, get, Roger Bagley. Ro- oh, the, yes, Roger Bagley. Get him over here. I want to see if he can do a soap grind. We got these new soap shoes that just came in, the camouflage, and they have uh, 18 pockets on them. Oh, 18 pockets. Uh, sign me oh. up. Nah, grind is, I got a big double set kink, uh, tri- triple kink rail out front of the shop. We want to see if he can do a soul grind on that one. Oh, soul. Oh, okay. I think you might be able to I'll do try it. I'm yeah. putting a demo it. tape together. We want to get a couple clips from you guys in there. I mean, you got a pop and skate shop out there. You're, it seems like you're killing it, bro. Inline skates, soap shoes, brother. bag full Dude, of chicken wings. The, shut the fuck up, will you? Yo. <laughs> Who is this? Who, who's this? It's Weck, dude. Weck, as in Wecking Ball? Yeah. What the fuck you doing on no, our line? Huh? Fucking, we're, <laughs> we're talking to Ricky D. Wecking Ball. Is huh? that your? Is yeah. that your yeah, uncle? Dude, we're at the supermarket. And took, yeah, he just took my phone. I'm trying, <laughs> I'm trying to get some chicken, dude. Like before you left the house, I'm like. Are you uh, oh, R- Ricky D? Is what are you that? Dude, I'm not getting chocolate chip cookies, bro. Put that shit back, dude. Now, are you God, checking to make sure on, that those cookies are uh, are uh, legitimate, authorized cookies? Dude, he, what did he get? A bagel and cookies, dude? Oh, my God. <laughs> what kind he of... He needs to get some greens. What's up? What's up? What are you guys doing? <laughs> <laughs> These colors suck. Listen, Weck, let me ask, let me ask you a question, bro. And we, we got to move this show along. But listen, bro, we, you came out here. We did the show. We had fun. It was a good time. Yeah, I, I noticed you, 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 you've been taking it easy on me lately, bro. You, you, haven't, you haven't wecked me or you anything, dude. What's going on? I got wecked well, dude, immediately I mean, after I the show. <laughs> so, immediately after. Who's that, Justin? Yep. Well, well, dude, I mean, he's, you're saying this stuff, and then right after you're going, you scrape. Like, <laughs> not a thing, bro. Justin, you, you said you were tripping on that clip, though. I was. <laughs> yeah. I even told the filmer, I'm like, dude, you had me tripping, and I was like, yo, yeah. is this cool? And he was like, dude, you didn't. Yeah, you gotta fire that filmer, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta fire that filmer. Because there's no way to tell, because he was so underneath. Yeah, dude. That's a real gray area. That's yeah, a gray, gray area. Any filmer out there uh, filming underneath the ledge in a manual? Wow. 
There you yeah, go. You know, yeah, I'll go do that. Through. Like the customer is always right. You know, time goes <laughs> yeah. to the runner. So if it looks like you touch, you touch. <laughs> Especially if you were dissing me the day before. <laughs> there you go. There you go. That's what you get. Definitely touch then. All right, guys. You yeah, you going to bed now? Yeah, we're we're nine fifteen at night. You need to go to sleep. Get you eight hours. <laughs> that's that's <laughs> right, Ricky D. Thank you, bro. Get you eight hours. All right, guys. Okay. Have uh, uh good luck with I that chick. Good, some of these crimson boards. Good luck with that mayonnaise chicken. Let me know if you. Let me know if you're here from CCS mail order. I got a uh, order with them. It's outstanding for about four years now. <laughs> okay. I want my crimson boots. Okay, crimson. We, we got you. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. Ready? All right, Ricky D. Later, dude. Later. All right. Peace. <laughs> All, right. All right. What a crazy family. You know? Dude. Wrecking ball. And his I uncle that was, his, was that his uncle? Yeah, he, yeah, oh, it was like, his uncle. Yeah. Oh. He's like, I'm here with my nephew. And then Wacking Wack Wack comes up. Yeah. That was insane. Mayonnaise chicken. Mayonnaise chicken. <laughs> chicken <laughs> lathered. Ever since we yeah. ever since we mentioned that, I used you, you had lost a Jesus, that mayonnaise very, chicken. very uncomfortable look on his face the whole time. <laughs> he didn't say anything about I, it. I know. He was <laughs> disgusted. I tapped out. Mayonnaise, <laughs> mayonnaise no good. Mayonnaise <laughs> chicken. No. no. Not for me, not for your boy. Okay, okay. <laughs> that does sound disgusting. Yeah. Uh, let's continue with the news. And um, well, Raj, they finally named the Supreme video blessed, blessed, blessed. Bill Strobeck was here. I was trying to get the name out of him. He wouldn't tell me. I don't really think he knew back then what it would be called. I think they kind of just came up with. Or did he know? Who the hell knows? Yeah. Who the hell <laughs> <Yeah>. knows? <laughs> Only no. he knows. Yeah. When does it come out? Supreme. They haven't, out. they haven't announced that they haven't yet. They haven't announced the date mm-hmm. yet. Yeah. They just kind of like let people know the name. But I think, didn't Tyshawn on our, our DOS Days show in New York, didn't he say maybe a couple months? Yeah, I think so. I would yeah. assume so if they put it out now. I mean, unless it's like back in the day when you put out Fully Flared and it comes out three years later. <laughs> yeah, no. Well, you know yeah, I mean, I mean the like, speed videos, yeah, you never know. Yeah, yeah, yeah but yeah, I yeah. think they're like, well, well you know, well, a well way. old machine over there. For kinda, sure. Uh, Those for sure. kids are killing it all the time. You yeah. Know? All oh, yeah. The time. Oh, I'm yeah. excited to see Sage footage, dude. Fuck yeah. That dude. Mm, gnarly. All those dudes mm-hmm. are sick, man. Yeah, all those dudes <laughs> fucking crush it. <laughs> Kevin Bradley. Oh, yeah. Dude, KB. <laughs> he's so tight, man. He's probably like, one of my amazing. favorite skateboarders. Sage, yeah. Just favorite people. Yeah. yeah. Like, he's so tight. And just carefree. You don't give a fuck. Like, mm-hmm. I love that shit. Yeah, he does some wild stuff on yeah, skateboard, dude. for real. Yeah. yeah. It's funny because he's just like a, such a down earth chill. Like, I mean, yeah. he's, he's Kevin Bradley. He's, yeah. he's a funny guy. But when you go skate with him, you're like, holy shit, yeah, that is right? so gnarly. Dude, I love seeing that shit, man. Him and knocking all those, like him knocking Tyshawn, watching them come up. Like, because I remember seeing KB at uh, the barracks when he was like getting on cliche. He was like a little tyke still, yeah. like crushing it. And now looking at him, like watching all three of those dudes grow and progress, like fucking black excellence, man. I love that <laughs> shit. Like, for real. That style shit. on point, though. They grew right in their style. Straight and up. Yeah. Killing it, man. I love it. That's right. Well, I can't wait for that one. That's going to be a good one, Raj. Yeah. You know, Supreme Video. Blessed. 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 What else we got? The shot, dude. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's like some skate of the year shit, dude. Jesus Christ! Yeah. You know, it's Again. funny. Remember when we were talking about the Instagram that he did? Like he, oh yeah, yeah, oh, where yeah. He was that, just, one, every, yeah. You know, every trick that one day, and then the and crook story. Just, the, oh yeah, the crook was from that day. Yep. Yep. That's right. Yep. And I was like, damn. He really went. He really went in. <laughs> he that day. Day. Yeah. fucking did a video part that day, but they used the crooked ground. Um, yeah, he, dude. You know what was tight too is like in the midst of all of that, there was like there's one clip that everyone reposted. But when I watched that, we did an Ollie front side flip, flip switch, switch crook. crook. I was like, whoa! Like I don't know. That's one of those. T- t- th- th- that's one trick you don't see too you don't, often. You no. never see that. Like maybe no. Nolly front heel switch crook. Mm, like that's yeah. more common. But yeah, did it all buttery too. Shut down LA high too. Dude. Oh yeah. Dude. Just don't even skating those banks anymore after that so, he is such a talented he fucking skateboarder. So he, de- he looks like he skates every single day all day i think he does he does and it comes across like yeah. there's just 
it's easy <laughs> for real though he he i could i say this sometimes but like he literally to me is like the michael jordan of skateboarding mm-hmm. for sure he has that same steez he has the tongue steez dude the tongue <laughs> sticking out <laughs> oh, yeah. it's like, he kills it dude. Yeah. <laughs> gary on skateline i know down. i was so mad that skateline came out before we filmed this because i could everything that gary said is exactly what i wanted to say oh, this dude. week wait dude. what did it's he so, say i didn't see just it. like he was just going in about him like fucking sticking his tongue out his mouth looking like and, like, looking like, yeah like <laughs> looking like a fucking pug that you know how pugs tongues get super long oh uh, yeah <laughs> It, it, nah, dude, it's it just was, like that's it's how he skates. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, yeah. <laughs> everybody's got Gary something. It. Yeah. yeah, but he doesn't see a skate with his tongue out. It's like more of like on his like upper lip. It's like it's in the corner of his mouth. Yeah. He sticks it out the corner of his mouth. Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah. Some Jordan shit. Everybody's got their thing, though. You know, like it's, sure. that's yeah. his thing. Jerry Sue had the fucking wrists. Like everybody's got something. That's right. Fuck, Chris got right. the hands behind his back. Handcuffs. The handcuffs. <laughs> handcuffs. Is that what you call them? Yeah, but it's not like you, you try. Like, just no, it's no, totally. Yeah, you know? yeah, like, yeah, maybe with the tongue happens. thing, too, it just happens. No, but absolutely. Sure. There's also the toothpick. Yo, but there, there is something to be said about, like, this dude just filmed a full part full of bangers for a fucking colorway. Oh, yeah. Yep. Not even his own pro shoe. He's got his name on the outsole. Right on the bottom. Didn't he just like, come out with a part two, like not that long ago? Not that long ago. So what I'm saying, like, what is it with, and I don't know if it's just Nike or what, but like, why are dudes just getting colorways of other shoes? Why are, like, I, I would be happy with a colorway of a blazer. Shit. That shoe yeah. sells really goddamn dude, well. So are they, getting, are they getting royalties for of sure. their own? For yeah, sure. Yeah. For yeah. sure. But, but would it be the same percentage as if they had their own pro shoe i think it would be less who knows 100 I mean, like, it's already it's cool i mean it's already a heritage shoe with them there it's already like right but at the same time it's already it's selling like, it's tough to I, make a, a good pro shoe i mean like look at right. like omar sellers had a shoe with nike fuck you took the words right out of my <laughs> mouth <laughs> that shoe didn't sell at all i know i know but Omar can say I had a pro shoe on Nike. Oh, totally. I didn't right, have a fucking right. Bruin colorway. I mean, I if you like, said you had a Bruin colorway, I'd be fucking hyped, dude. I, I, I'd I'd be, be hyped too. <laughs> yeah. I get it, but I just I don't know. I feel like somebody like a shot or somebody like Shane who got his own pro shoe on a, somebody else's pro shoe. Like things like that. that it, that's right. funny when like Shane having a, a colorway for a Janelle's shoe yeah, was right. a little Random. strange. Yeah. yeah. But But I mean if a shoe's doing well. As a shoe, he just, wants to you might as yeah. well just put your name on you. It's, be, it's better chances you'll get better check if even if the royalties are a little smaller, mm-hmm. you get a better check for sure because it's a proven shoe that sells. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know what you're saying. Though. I, no, 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 I know yeah, what you're saying. Hundred sure. percent. Just from I just think that I don't know from a different perspective. Somebody who like appreciates footwear and shoes like that. I would. I personally would like to have an Ashad wear pro model shoe that I could hold. They could in the be working ball on one. They could be. They could be. I doubt it. No, you never nah. know. And I, I, just, I, was, I think I, it's hard, I, dude. I personally think it's hard for pro shoes to be going out there these days. It's just, yeah. It's, mm-hmm. I mean, if there, if there was, there's got to be a reason, dude. Like, if like yeah. no, there has like, to be a reason. I yeah. just want to know what it is. Like, if, like, if his colorway goes off and it's just completely sold out, they, they might be like, hmm, we could probably make a shoe with his name on it. I doubt it. The only, only thing is because I know just like the way those contracts work and shit like that. Like, if you don't have a contract, uh, a pro shoe in your contract, like you're not getting that shit. Mm. Well, with they did Nike, the, they did anyway, the Nike. With Nike. I mean, I'm sorry. They did the. I'm sorry. They did the the dunk. Well, they made like the re the new dunk with like a shod. Like that's pretty. It's the same shit. But that's amazing, all the dude. Stuff? Dude, they don't... they took the fucking stuffing out of all the dunks and yeah. like slimmed them down. But that's something that Nike was already doing. And Jordan Brand, like Jordan yeah. Brand took the fucking, they did the deconstructed twos. Like it's something that Nike was already doing. They just, here, we're going to attach you to this because we feel like it'll sell more because your name is a part of this. Dude, you got to do the stand back and think about what's going I on. I understand. No, I but, No, trust me. I yeah. get where all of you are coming from. I'm not man out. I get it. But. It's like this dude fucking earned his stripes. He earns his own pro model shoe. I don't give a fuck what nobody says. A pro model shoe is something. It means something to people. Like if you listen to what Paul said when he first left S to get on Nike, mm-hmm. he was like, if I don't get a pro shoe, I'm not signing the contract. Oh, yeah. Well, because that's his dream. Exactly. Yeah. But that's what I mean. Like there's something to be said about. But, but if a, enough skate shops and enough kids were like, hey, we want a shot shoe, they'll make it. Hey, they should that, do yeah. the Cortez shoe, though. I try that, know, I, for I, real. I think the Cortez. I've seen a bunch hard. of kids have done some mock ups and send them through yeah, like some hard. of them look really good hell yeah and then you have one that's similar already similar to what the Cortez yeah the, it, it, the, the Bruin Low is that what you mean I don't know if it's a Bru- no it's a it has oh a, no a Cortez Upper oh you know? no, I don't know actually, but it's like but sure. suede toe and it's it has the same silhouette <laughs> oh okay I, I honestly haven't seen yeah. that one yet yeah. dude uh, with the shod shoe did you see the Shane O'Neill shit that we did the oh half- yeah the f- how is he 
he's getting the little, little flat bar he does, the half cab crook, the switch front crook. That was fucked up. Dude. Yeah, why? What the? F- so good. And the, How- like his little like skips on the way in where he's showing the shot under oh, the soul and that shit. That was so good. He's, that, was, that was fucking clever. Oh, yeah. That the, was sick as fuck. The Instagram cover page. Uh-huh. That. I was like, yeah, oh, I see. Yeah, those dudes are. Any word on his new company? Nothing, huh? I don't think yeah, anything's popped nothing, up yet. Nothing. No. Okay. Work in progress. Yeah, of course. Hey, well, congrats to Ashad on that absolutely. part. Either way, Insane. absolutely. The part was fucking incredible. We skated to Return of the Mac, which oh, is so good. Ashad. So good. Like, that's I kind of have a problem with that, though. What's oh, up? I did go. a uh, Gang of Malto edit years ago to that song. Oh, oh he definitely saw that. I was like, I want this song. Yeah. <laughs> <Sure>. <laughs> it's definitely what happened. But it happens a lot, though. People oh, reuse songs. Yeah, yeah. You know? I shot it fit in perfect. Okay. Wait, Gang no. of Malta. What, what was that for? Was it that was the best of four star. Like, oh, okay, okay. Let me tell you something, bro. <laughs> okay. I, no, I think this is correct information, but okay. Like on the Crail Tap, it's on Crail Tap, right? Yeah. On Crail Tap, remember that I did the video shit pro skaters say? Yeah. So that that pro shit, shit pro skater say is number two of all time Crail Tap videos. Gang of Malto is number one, I think. Oh, oh no! What? Yeah, <laughs> I think that is correct. Return of the Mac, like, dude. Damn. Everybody out there, go watch Shit Pro Skater say. <laughs> Get that fucking thing at number one for Christ's sake. Yo, you were you were, you were tapped in like you had your finger on the pulse with that Shit Pro Skater say because that shit was popping off I just thought, like I YouTube thought, world. I, I thought like, of the whole thing. Not true. Oh. <laughs> Not true. <laughs> well, somebody in your camp was tapped in to fucking. It was an Alex way. Olsen idea, and then Mesa ran. Alex didn't even want to do it. It was just an idea. They were going to do it with Alex, right? And he, Alex well, was like, Alex, I don't want to do it. Like, it's just an idea. Me and Alex were going to do it. We yeah. talked about it. And then Mesa took the idea and ran with it. With yeah, you. because I heard me, Alex didn't want to do it. Yeah. Yeah. I feel yeah, like he would be good yeah. at it, too. He would have killed it. Uh, he yeah. would have been great, I feel like. Yeah. Excuse me. But Rob- no, no, no. But you, you, <laughs> nah, you did great. You, you did great. You killed it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell, Josh, bro. Hey, no, no, bro. You did Thank great. You, I would yeah. say I would say he would good. I think he would be funny to but see him do it. It would too. be funny to see Alex do it, but I feel like Chris embodies that character yeah, in dude. real life. Like, that's really you. Anybody got so any wax? Like, <laughs> 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 what the fuck is my Allen key? Yeah. <laughs> no, it was a fun video to do. It was a fun video. But I think that's number two. Fuck no. 2011 or something. 11 or 12. It was when all those things were uh, coming out and shit. Did they do a filmer one? They did. They did. Yeah, yeah. with uh, Burnett. Uh, Did it do as well, though? <laughs> um, but yeah, I think that's number. I think that's uh, second of number two number two all time Crail Tap videos. Damn, you know, so hard. go watch that. Uh, on other, uh, thank you, Kelly. Yeah. Uh, one star, what is this? One, <laughs> one star world tour? What is this? Uh, converse video. Con- oh, does it mean no converse video? <laughs> I thought it was a world tour. I didn't know I was supposed to watch this thing. Well, thought it's it was kind of a- funny because like converse says, puts world tour in there, but seriously, like it's like the south, like New, like New Orleans footage, or whatever, like in like Atlanta, and then it's like Europe or something, after, Paris right? and like England. Yeah, oh. They cover the world without I mean, one. They, but it was yeah. tight. It was, a, it was a lot of new heavy hitter kids, mm-hmm. man. Yeah, there was a lot of people that it was never incredible. heard of. Yeah. yeah. Was it? Oh, man. I had, I had to screenshot his name because I'd never heard of this dude's name. Was it Cal? Oh, they came from Brazil. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. Oh, Cal yeah. Casa? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, that dude's Yeah, Cal, Cas- Cal Casa? It's like Casa. I'm sorry there, if yeah, I'm yeah. butchering your name. Butchering we your do name, that dude, all the but time. But you, <laughs> you, that dude. He's buttery. He's incredible yeah. dude that guy i've never heard of that dude and i'm i'm a big fan is he yeah. uh brazil uh cons i think he's brazilian so, yeah. Yeah. yeah he came out swinging in yeah, that one his shit was lit. so it was a yeah. world tour video i thought this was a tour that they were about to do and everything i think it was just a That's... way for them to push the one star shoe oh mm-hmm. okay. they did pretty good i was i watched dude, the video fully That's a really good edit yeah yeah like whoever did it killed it oh we don't know who edited it huh um i can't remember his oh. name we, hmm. we can look it up or yeah. whatever. I don't know, but it was... Fucking t- it's like Justin Cam or something. Or mm. I don't even know. Okay. Bobby DeKaiser. Bobby DeKaiser, yeah. Mm. I I it, was, it was pretty rad fuck. being like him being towed in on the uh, electric skateboard. <laughs> <laughs> Just get a mani pad or whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, did yeah. Uh, Mike Some, Anderson have shit in there too? No. Nah. It no. was all like the younger no, no squad. Kenny, no, no Kenny. No Kenny. No Ben Raymers or anything like that. You know what was sick about the Bobby DeKaiser? And this has it's nothing to do with his actual skating. But like one of the last clips, he was wearing uh, a New York hat. No, he was wearing a New York hat, but it had the old Shorty's Wave logo. Hmm. I don't know if anybody knows. It was I, like I, a, I, I saw that and yep. I thought it looked like a. a it was a Shorty's, Shorty's logo. logo. I was like, really? That, yeah. 
Pull huh. it like roll the roll the fucking clip. That shit was in there. I was like, damn, that Dude, was tight. Is Shorty's I, coming back right now? I don't know what the deal is. I don't is. know. They've I've, they've had an Instagram account for a minute. And I've seen shit popping it's up. Good time, but I, I saw for some real. hipster ass dude like I remember where I was, but he had like the shorties. Like if you fold it, it says like fuck you. Have you seen I've that? seen oh, them. Yeah, 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 I've yeah. seen those out there. It's like yeah. fuck off or fuck yeah, you or something like that. Yeah, oh, interesting. The big ghetto child. Ghetto child's back. Oh, is it? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, that's, yep. but that's been back for a little while. Though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like Shorty's though. Right. I thought Ghetto Child was like kind of the same. It, it was used to be. distributed by um, them back in the yeah, day. Yeah, back in the day. Um, yeah. okay. mm-hmm. Now, like, it's like Tony Tave and Tori mm-hmm. and Brayden. Brayden, yeah. 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 Twan. Joe from Springfield, Massachusetts. Huh? Oh, Raj. Is that anywhere close to where? It was about like an hour from where I grew up. An hour from where Raj yeah. grew up. Okay. What's going on? Uh, I've already forgot your name, bro. What was it again? Joe. 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 <laughs> it's Joe. 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 Um. First, I'd like. First, yeah, Joe. Joe. Yeah. First, I'd like to say I really love what you guys are doing. It's the highlight of Monday. So. Thank you, bro. Don't forget Good Thursdays. Up, boys. Thank you. Oh, Thursday too. Every yeah. other Thursday as well. Oh uh, yeah. I'm drinking my nighttime tea out of my switch flip switch maybe mug too as well right now. Hey, God Damn. bless you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the order. God, God bless, bless you. God bless you. <laughs> Go ahead, Joe. What do you got um, for us? Um, I just recently took like a killer slam or, or a slam mm-hmm. to my back, and it got me really thinking if I should still skateboard or not. Because, well, how, old, um, how old are you, bro? I'm 33, and I just kind of do it for like fun mm-hmm. on the weekends, like therapeutic type of stuff. But um, I got a rip fracture and three fractured vertebrae from this. Whoa, Jeez, bro. Dude, really God. freaking me out. <laughs> what? Do I what, mean... Do what your doctor yeah. t- tells you to do first. Yeah, I mean, are you, yeah. like, laid up right now? Can you walk around? I mean, that's serious shit. No, I can walk around right now. It's not worse than it really is, but... um. Okay, well, you yeah, know what? Eldridge has had like back problems. Trip. We're going to fly Eldridge out there, and he's going to be your personal trainer. Oh, wow. I'll tell you what, Joe. <laughs> I, I went through the same shit, kind of, and I was in the same predicament where I was like... Do I want to do this anymore? Because it's just, you know what I mean? You get to that point and you're like, is it worth it? But if you concentrate on healing yourself first and not even worry about, you know, getting back on the board, the board, I promise you, will eventually follow. It'll like, always be there. Yeah, that, that that's what happened to me. I was, okay. I was okay. done until my body said i could do it could again do it. And and how long was that that took you like a like, year or something, it was, right yeah i mean it was a, a better it was six months and it was like a better better half of a year like okay you yeah. know a little bit more than six months but dude i went right. through the same shit like seven millimeter herniation in between l4 and l5 and yeah. like Damn. it got to a point where there was literally points where i couldn't get out of bed yeah. without oh, like man. shooting pains down my leg yeah. like it felt so like it. imagine just like a hot wire going from your hip to your yeah. big toe like that oh, was damn. me for like That's maybe a better part of two years yeah so yeah. I, I we both you know me and Eldie both understand your pain and what you're going through mine was a little bit different because it was discs and it wasn't actually the uh, fracture in the vertebrae oh a fracture so that i can't imagine you know what the healing is for that or like what i you wonder what's worse through. though a fracture of the vertebrae or a herniated disc I mean, I feel like I they're know. different in their extremes. Yeah, yeah. you know, if they got a fracture, you just gotta chill yeah. for a yeah. while. You just, I mean, on both of them, yeah, just heal up, right? Just gotta, yeah, because a herniation is hitting your nerve root, so that's sending like yeah, that's pain right, down right, your yeah, leg. Right, so right. It, it's it kind of goes away from where the 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 actual like injury is mm-hmm. um the vertebrae and you can attest to this, Joe. I don't know. I imagine your pain is kind of centralized in your back, where that like where that uh, fracture is, right? Yeah, it's it's definitely in the back. Um, it's kind of hard to tell exactly which is which because I do have a fractured rib from it too. Oh, there you go. Jeez, so you're just hurting all over. Yeah, damn, dude. Yeah, I'm just basically hurting all over. What did the doctor say? Did they give you a timeline? Like, hey, do, do, don't do anything for um, X amount of months, or? Well, I just saw my primary care Thursday, and she wanted me out till August twenty second. But she did say this, if I had a job where I was just sitting down, she would have cleared me to go back to work, but I don't have that type of job. Oh, mm. what do you do? Contractor or something? Yeah. Or? No, I, I work at a group home for mentally challenged adults. Okay. So you got to be on your feet all day. Wow. Yeah. I got to be on my feet just in case something crazy happens. If someone, for lack of a better word, gets out of line and right. we got to do holds for safety reasons and stuff like that. So Joe, geez. you got to be ready to go, man. Yeah. Basically. <laughs> yeah. I feel the same way with uh, all these clowns over here. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> gotta be on your toes down here. <laughs> Fuck that. 
this clowns. <laughs> you know we're sitting right here. Right? Listen, Joe, I, I, listen, man. Well, Joe, man, like, I, well, I mean, what, what do you do with that? I mean, you just, it's a bone, right? They can't put you in a cast. They can't, like, yeah. you just got to let it heal. Yeah, I just got to let it heal. Yeah. And um, I actually, the weird thing is I got a follow-up with um, the surgeons because I went to the ER because my breathing was weird. Mm. And oh, um, my breathing's fine now, but yeah, it was from the rib, but mm -hmm. my breathing's fine now, but when I see the surgeons on the ninth, they're going to tell me like more like how I'm doing, like okay. what to do from there. So well, listen, I think, I think Eldridge gave you the best advice anybody could ever give you because he's yeah. been through it and he said, just focus yeah. on getting healed and doing your thing and and the, the, the skateboard will follow yeah. you know and big dog the 22nd is it'll okay. be here in a snap of a finger i know, you does, know that I mean? seems like, too short though yeah it seems I, like I, I would wait even longger no yeah. for sure it's yeah. your back dude don't yeah. fuck with that i know? just think you know it's like you're not skating every yeah. day going out trying to fucking like get clips if it's something that's therapeutic and recreational i don't think there's i'm not a doctor obviously but i, I don't think there's any reason for you to have a thought of you not being able to do that from time to time. You know, you're 33. Like I do feel like as like what LD said, as long as you allow your body to heal itself and you go through the motions mm -hmm. and you really just like listen to your body, don't try and push it. Don't try and do anything extra and, and just mm -hmm. try and be healthy. You'll, you'll for sure be back on your board. There you go, sure. man. There you go. And LD took a whole right. different, he took a whole health approach too, man. You were yeah. eating right and, and exercise. Hey, you were doing all, right. all paleo all this shit you really do gotta like you know it's it's the whole thing you know what i mean it, it, it is it's eating it's diet it's all that shit you know water is a huge factor so like dude just fucking get healthy you know what i mean there you go there you and go. then you'll start all over okay. again man okay. Skate, like when you it. start skating again it's yeah. like you take it slow and you start relearning things and it kind of becomes fun yeah, you, sure. you have this weird like you almost, yeah, you know, start, appreciate you appreciate, exactly, yeah. you appreciate it yeah. from a different perspective. Yeah, like, like, I already knew how to do this, but I can do it again. I can do it again yeah. from not being able to. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not, I'm telling you, Raj, remember I was yeah. saying I get hurt in my sleep? I the other day I, I woke up and bottom of my foot was all fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> The bottom of your bottom, bottom of my foot was all fucked up. Fucked I couldn't up even out. walk to the kitchen. Like what are you cramp? dreaming about? Like I don't know. Or something? I don't know. Walking, sleep kicking. The Joe, hey. Joe, you ever you ever wake up hurt? You have to wear shoes to bed or something. <laughs> this guy, and, and you're telling me I say shit people don't say. I would never fucking hear that come out of anybody's mouth. But I'm just Chris telling Roberts. you the truth. Like I get hurt in my sleep, dude. <laughs> I wonder what you're doing. You're I have like, no idea. You're just fucking like doing karate and shit when dancing. you're like, yeah. uh, <laughs> just wakes up his foot swollen. You're like, what the what? fuck? <laughs> Weirdest shit. Is your bed next to your wall? Weirdest shit. Yeah, but I wonder if you're like kicking your he's wall. He's probably kicking. Yeah, hey, Chris, you're probably I have twitching. I a question for you. Go ahead, go ahead, Joe. These people are out of their mind kicking the wall. <laughs> Where <laughs> the are you? <laughs> 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 um, I, I just was wondering, did you? board royalties go up since doing the podcast let me tell you joe down. <laughs> i've i i have i'm i'm, I'm killing the game uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah get just, a board on eBay for, for three hundred bucks. <laughs> and hey, hey, he's got three flavors in lacrosse three, now. Three first time in Crail yes, in, in chocolate girl history that, that I had more than one multiple colorways. Multiple colorways in yeah. one one off. Damn. Whatever they're called. <laughs> 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 Called one off, yeah. Sure. Collection. Series. There Collection. There you go. No, Joe, to be honest with you, I, I don't even know. I don't, I don't even look at that stuff. You, you don't go in mean? there and demand to see the board sales? No, I don't even know. We get direct deposit and all. I don't even like look. <laughs> I don't even care. <laughs> What's, what's so funny? Be nice. No, it's funny because right. you have this, bro, this character where you're like, dude, I'm fucking killing the game. And you're like, seriously? You're like, seriously, I don't, I don't, I don't care. I don't, I, don't care. Care. <laughs> I don't. I don't care. So, Joe, I, I couldn't answer that. I have no idea, dude. No idea. The answer is yes, Joe. Thank you. Thank you, Eldridge. Thank you, Eldridge. Eldridge knows more than I do. Hey, but Joe, listen, man, we got to move things along. Hey, best of luck with your yeah, back, dude. Real. Hey, like yeah. a heal, heal up. up before you got do you. go out and do anything, bro. Okay, it's your back. Don't don't mess oh, around. Oh, for sure. Yeah. yeah. Listen to your doctor. Well, listen again, Joe. Take care of yourself. Hell yeah, man. Positive vibes. Yeah. Positive, yeah. yeah. Real, real. You'll, you'll heal Take up. it easy. Take yeah, it you'll, easy. You're 33 years you. old, man. It, you're still young, I'm dude. I'm the same age, dude. Like, yeah. It take, just, I know it, when you get older, you seem like it's... It's oh, I don't know what, I don't know what to do. Apart. Dude, just give it some time. You'll be fine. Yeah. 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 Thanks, Joe. <laughs> Thank you. All right. You have a good evening.
You too, Chris. Thank you, bro. See ya. See ya. Later. Later. What are we, right, chopped bye. liver? <laughs> 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 good guy that joe i like joe connection i like joe good good dude huh yeah Hope he, he definitely seems like a little spooked Hope but he i think up. yeah well you dude. know what anything it's your back dude i'd no, be trust me too, I, I know, know yeah. dude i went through two years of it yeah like it's, yeah. it's remember no you threw my fun. back out that one day yeah dude we're skating the um that curve like stage or whatever yeah. oh, God. i all laid up the stage and my back just went compressed on itself mm -hmm. i was on the ground for like three hours yeah. Yeah. that's uh, i remember you in the grass and you gotta yeah. hop the fence dude were you worried to try to get out of that place someone ran and got me like advil or something like that and like it took hours <laughs> Ad for, for it to like, for it to, like kick in yeah it looks like it's some voodoo shit where like you're just like standing there and you're still <laughs> yeah. And he just like yeah. collapsed. No. You're like, what's yeah. wrong with that sure. dude? Dude, the yeah. back is dude. no joke. It's man. no yeah. fucking joke. Yeah. And it's weird because it's not like a physical you, you can't like, thing move. you can. Yeah. No. You, but people can't see it. So they think you're joking. Right. Or yeah. like, they, you know, it's like, it just doesn't look like it's a real thing. Yeah. But dude, that's. And that's mm. the thing, too, with like an ankle or a wrist or this or that. You're just like, oh, just go through the natural, natural healing process of yeah. doing it. And then it's just your back or your neck or something. Back it's, is it's no not joke. Yep. Bottom of your foot. <laughs> You know, it's scary. When you wake up with this, your bottom of your foot fucked up, Kelly, you'll but, okay. So what? What dude, was fuck? It was what? a swollen or like? Yeah, what? dude, it was swollen. I like wa I got up to take a step and I was like, whoa, dude. Did and I be? It, no, you probably I got mean, bed bugs, dude. You have dirty ass apartment, dude. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I was kidding. about to say, <laughs> LD said he would eat his toenails last time because it was super clean. My shit's clean as fuck. Yeah, but clean as you know what? Fuck, I dog. thought maybe a spider bite or, you know, you get the random No, things. the spider bite sounds right, to be honest. But it's yeah. weird, though, yeah, because yeah. Larry's around my cat and Larry gets all the bugs. Is she like not, hang by her not feet? Not that we have a lot of bugs, but fleas. It's just maybe. weird. Yeah, I woke great. up and it was like Wait, swollen, how? but then it, it went away okay. after like 30 minutes. It might have just been like a fluid what? build up or something, maybe. You're weird. Like, Wait, it was swollen for thirty minutes when you woke up. It wasn't up? even like swollen. Like it just. Yeah, you, it just felt. I weird. feel like it probably was like flu. You just had to move around a little bit and like kind of get some yeah. like blood flowing and shit. <laughs> Chris Roberts get problems. Get These know, are right? literally only Chris Roberts problems. <laughs> like I can't say I've woken up with a swollen foot before, but I can I can see how that could happen <laughs> somewhere. Same. You know, I'm on your side, Robert. Thank I, you, bro. I got you, dog. Thank you, Caesar. <laughs> Listen, we got one more thing to talk about, and then maybe we'll take another call, though. Uh, Kelly? Spencer Hamilton. There you go. That's my dog. There you go. Yeah. Guy's gnarly. He's always been gnarly, but he, always. Hey, he had a fucked up back, I think, too. He did. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Crazy. I heard about that. Yeah. But he didn't look like he had a back problem now. Looking solid no, as he's fuck. Yeah. yeah, dude. Best front side half cap flips in the game. And switch back side flips. Yeah. And it just doesn't he's got it congrats on that pro shoe big dog yo yeah. honestly though i always go off the fucking rails i'm so sorry but it wasn't until he had his instagram name monsanto kills that i looked into what monsanto was and like oh, yeah. all the shit that they're a part of and it was like oh, he whoa was, monsanto was fucked yeah he's he was heavy when he heavy, first started pro like the yeah. whole pro campaign when he on yeah. expedition, it was all about that right he brought a lot of awareness that. awareness oh, that, sure. exactly just just that alone made me research like yeah. oh my god did he it's switch not. his name back already? To it's Spencer, Spencer Hamilton. Oh, it is. Yeah. Okay. One yeah. month's on a product put a stop to it. <laughs> no, but yo, shout out to Spinny. That elevates shoe for Supra. That video part mm -hmm. was, was amazing. Yeah. So good. So yeah. Did the, uh, the front side half cab flip and then front 360 down the stairs in Germany whatever dude oh yeah he's that got a great was, he's got one of the best front 360s so too yeah. Yeah. and he's got yeah. a good, he always reps he reps the Vario flips and big like fuck yeah and v bombs for <laughs> days <laughs> thank you very much <laughs> hey if you could do them well exactly do them. Yeah. Yeah. yeah for real I yeah. love a good v -bomb. did you watch his part he had a good uh, switch foot manning in there. He did. Oh, I got tagged oh, down in the it. stairs. I, got, I saw that. Yes. I got tagged. Gnarly. In it. That yeah. one seemed Wait, oh, the, the, where he gave the kid the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so I, saw, like, I did see that. Cleared like seven stairs. Yeah, yeah. He had to go fast. Yeah, that was a good one. But that's that spot in in downtown uh, in Vancouver, right? Vancouver, yeah. yeah. Isn't that the old school spot they used to skate back in the day? I think it might be. Dude, you know where they used to skip yeah, the stairs yeah, yeah, and go yeah. back around? Yeah. They remodel it, and that's what it became. I think. Wait, what? Do you remember that? Like, it was, like, the old, like, virtual like Tony reality, Ferguson. Oh. No, no, not not new spot. They would call that new spot, I think. No, but no, there no. was a, the other spot where they had the stairs up and going down. That's oh, the okay. spot. Yeah. Though, hmm. I was thinking Tony Ferguson stayed at the other spot too. And now it's a new spot. This is confusing. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. Oh. But anyways, uh, the new spot was Third Army. This oh man, I don't want to get into this. <laughs> 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 uh, Do you remember shit. what new trick was? New trick? Yeah. No, what was new trick? It was the front side 180 to like um, switch crooks. 
on like flat bars oh. or like on a ledge you know like you never heard that like, like straight on like scott, like scott johnston yeah scott johnston but people oh. call it new trick in the very beginning really yeah never new, heard trick. That. new trick oh. what well, are you still in boston up? yeah oh no wonder <laughs> but that was that like a jerry trick? flipped jerry follow flipped out of it too Oh. Yeah, one of you tricks I'm telling you, man, that's Scott Johnston at the Beneficial or the new oh, spot called uh, Best Trick Ever Jay Filmed, Jay maybe? Kwan. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Music, everything. Oh, everything, everything my God. Yes. about yes. it. Hey, dude, I saw a yeah. clip on his Instagram or was on a story and he was just skating a park up in Portland. Killing oh it. my god he, he just did a manual and a 50 50 and a quarter pipe and then a backside grind Still has best and style. i was like the best dude yeah. the, you're the best what's yeah. the thing like he, <laughs> he, he like gave a he quit professional skateboarding to become a shoe designer for like lakai he didn't even he didn't like stop. he was so he has been and always will be so fucking good yeah but i respect him wanting to follow his uh sure. his passion you Absolutely. know and like and like hanging that up to, to go do his new thing and look at now like, he's at adidas oh yeah, yeah. 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 Killing, it. killing it right yeah. right he's Scott just an all-around talented like person and you know great dude we got to get him on the show yes bro. please yeah, yeah. Sure. next time he's down in town gotta get him Great dude. Mr. Clean. Mr. Yeah. Clean. Scott Johnston. No one could replicate his style at all. It's yeah. like, no, it, all. it's only him and that's, mm -hmm. it's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. It's well, beautiful yeah. Thing. Spencer Hamilton, good job on that Elevate part. I'll watch it later. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take one more call. Uh, Put the pressure on him. Tell him this is the last call. Let's see. This is uh, Saul from Santa Ana. What's good? How you doing tonight? OC. Pretty good, man. Yourself? Hey, excellent. What do you got for us? Who should be on uh, the Mount Rushmore of skating? Oh, <laughs> that's a good question. Yeah, well, wait, a wait a minute. There's question. four people on Mount Rushmore, right? One, two, three, yeah. four. So yeah. Your face is one of them. Of course. I, I'm on there, Saul. <laughs> you doing a switch with Manny. That's another one. That's two. <laughs> the Hamilton. No, that's a good question. <laughs> the Hamilton. <laughs> the Hamilton. <laughs> oh, the Hamilton's on the third. <laughs> yeah. And LaCroix. Oh, and LaCroix. And LaCroix. Yeah. There you go. There, there's your Mount Rushmore. Thanks for calling, Saul. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding no i feel like everybody's probably got their yeah. own Mount oh Rushmore, totally you know? totally who's on yeah. yours oh my god i mean you gotta throw penny on there wow. tom penny yeah, yeah, of course you gotta throw uh jay gotta, who jay adams jay adams well chris yeah. doesn't think so <laughs> <laughs> well that, that that is he on your uh mount rushmore saul as far as like an OG, yeah. Okay, not really my like not really my generation. Not really my generation. I wouldn't really put him up on the. No offense, but this is my Mount Rushmore. <laughs> Tom Penny. Um, I mean, day one. You know, day one's a good. He's one. a good like That's one of my all time day favorites, one. dude. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I'm almost leaning towards a Muska too, because be. Muska mm -hmm. did it some yep. shit. Changed face of skateboarding forever mm -hmm. you know in my eyes raj <laughs> one more person can't put myself on there that'd be a little too uh narcissistic there you go <laughs> which i'm not i'm not at all you know not in the slight god who's the fourth bro costin oh my god i mean costin Dude, there's two. There's a lot to pick from, man. You, like, you, you name you this name four, you leave four off. Yeah, Saul. You know what? I'll throw yes. cost in for now. I can't think of anybody else. Um, Steezus, do you have a, a four top four? My uh, Mount Rushmore skating. Um, Muska. Okay, for sure. Uh, Kareem Campbell. Okay, there you go. Um, Danny Montoya. Ooh, oh, yeah. interesting. Which sideburns or without sideburns? Um, Duff's Danny I was going to say like Duff's. Rhythm, <laughs> like, like, like rhythm, rhythm style? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's a good um, And then Stevie. The Stevie old Williams. Stevie Williams. Yeah. 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 Okay. Kelly? Brian Wayne. Gino. Man, this is tough. I mean, it's four it is people. Hard, like, yeah, it's, I, I'll so say many. Van England. Okay. And... Oof. Ave with the fucking cornrows, though. Oh, yeah, yeah, at all stages. Bro, switchback nose grind 180s with the cornrows. So, with sh and oh, huh. maybe Kenny Anderson. Okay. I, he, I, his style, dude, like, yeah. it's, uh, it's like you're like. I sure. Know, yep. dude. Okay. Yeah. Eldridge? Uh, Costin. Sure. Guy. Old oh, guy. Yeah. Um, Tony Hawk. Okay. Um, 
Um, you got to give props to Tony. That's right. Yeah, he has right. to be yeah. there. He yeah, has to be. Sure. Are you switching one out? No, <laughs> for, nah, no? Okay, nah. you're keeping your four. Keeping, yeah, okay. yeah. And um, he's an honorable mention. Gons. There you go. Oh, wow. Gons. Wow. That was, sol- you, that you, was no, the most yeah. solid, solid one. one for sure. Look at Fuck yeah. <laughs> Sometimes he's got good ones. His hand motions yeah. are the best. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you came correct with that one. That was, good. that was good. Okay, Raj, what about you? This is going to be interesting. I mean, I have to agree with a, a couple of his. Go ahead. Tony, Gons, Rodney Mullen. Ooh, Ooh yeah, Rodney, that's a good yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I feel like Rocco has to be on there. Oh, Rocco. Really? Mm. Yeah. Okay. He kind of changed like, it. Okay. Well, it's, this Go is ahead. like it's it's a weird one because you're talking about like personal ones that are kind yeah, of yeah, going yeah. To, like skateboarding as a whole. Yeah. Well, if it's well this is Raj's list. Whole, yeah. 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 It's his list. Yeah. He could pick whoever he wants. Yeah, right. Phelps should be on there too. And well, you can only pick four. I know. Yeah. <laughs> Saul. Yes, sir. What about you, ma'am? Oh fuck! <laughs> I'd, I'd put Jay Adams on there for uh, breaking the mold. Okay. Of the skaters back in the day, Tony Hawk. Tony Hawk. Chris Markovich. Oh, damn. Interesting. Crimson. Crimson. Yeah. <laughs> and, Apple, and Apple Yard. Apple damn, Yard. Man. Apple. Nice. That's a good one. Yeah, man. Great artist. Nine Club mm, alum. Man. Makes great hey, mugs. Let me tell you, Saul. That was a great question, bro. That's, That's a, a really great question. question. Great, great question. question. Maybe the caller of the night. Totally. But Yo, you, know you know what? what? I do want to sub out before Go we get rid oh. of before we get rid of him. I'll tell you why. I'm gonna sub out Danny. Danny, I love you, but I'm gonna have to put Barra there because Barra gave me a chance in the industry and let me do shit on the barracks. Okay. And because of that, I'm forever indebted to him. So sure. I feel like I I have to. What about me and the, the opportunity I gave you here at the nine club? Uh, Kelly hit me up. About that, so. <laughs> Who do you think told Kelly to hit you up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kelly. Uh, Kelly does hey, my. Dog. It's my dog right yeah, here. Yeah. That's why we it's chill next yeah, to each other, this, bro. That's why I chose this table, and you know, I kicked, I kicked LD. You know, so it's. Uh, do you know how easy it is to get kicked off the show? <laughs> as easy as it is to get on the show. <laughs> okay, Jesus. Saul, you need a job that pays nothing. Yeah, I'm down. See? Yeah. <laughs> See how easy it is, Jesus. Hey, it's huh? volunteer work, dog. Just I'll cruise get, on up. <laughs> Oh, they, see? There, hey, you go. there you go. There you go. Steezus only brings one Yo, for himself. Yo, I brought a 40 for myself, player. So yeah, I brought Zima's last week. What are you talking about, dog? That's true. That's true. Dude, Damn. That's that true. 40's getting to it's him. Go- He's getting pissed. Is that, a, is, that, <laughs> it's Mickey's. is that a Mickey's 40? Mall liquor, baby. Yeah, Jesus. 40. It's, you come it's every time me. with a different he's, one? He, yeah, he's it's like seriously, a mystery. <laughs> he's seriously it's on like this, my thing now. <laughs> he's seriously on this high school tip. Yeah, I've been drinking a 40. Trying to relive. Should we do something where like Steezus will have a 40 in a bag? And you have to guess. You have to guess, guess what, it is. what it is. I mean, I could tell right there. It's a. Yeah. It's yeah. a Mickey. Well, yeah, yeah. sure. One hundred percent. I had to finally come with the Mickey or with the forty because I've been talking about it for the past like three episodes. So do it's they like, make big ass fucking... Zimas? <laughs> no, but Zima fucking Saul. hook it up. I would definitely That'd be, be a down. headache, dude. Yes, sir. God, <laughs> Saul, you got a you got a forty uh, preference? Uh, forty, honestly, I growing up. Uh, I think uh, King Cobra is over Mickey's. Okay, King Cobra. Yeah. Okay, okay. Right. Everybody goes, when they're talking about 40s, everybody goes back to back in the day. Yeah. There ain't nobody. Yeah, you're not finding Well, you yeah. can't find yeah. 40s anymore. Half I had to, exactly. I had to search yeah. for this joint today. I was oh, like, the fuck. King Cobras were like 99 cents or something, right? Or $1.99 or something. Didn't they have like the sticker on them? They had a good price, yeah. 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 Well, had a good price. Well, they were making these yeah. on like plastic bottles, weren't they? Yeah, I saw. Because um, yeah, everyone was breaking yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yo, yeah. in Missouri, they don't sell 40s anymore because it's considered a deadly weapon. You have to go oh. across the state line to Kansas to get a. 40. I mean, it's, it's a crazy. big bottle. It's a big yeah. bottle. It's a yeah. big boy. It's, it's a big a boy. Weapon. <laughs> hey, real. Saul, man, thank you so much for the call and the and the question. That was the best question of the night, man. Thank you. Nightclub skate edit. Oh, that's you know people ask us that all the time, dude. Chris like, doesn't skate. That's the only problem. He's a fucking asshole. I do. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Oh, the problem is, Saul, is we're so goddamn busy doing this show that we it's hard, man. We need someone to free up our time. Saul, can you edit, bro? <laughs> hey, I, I can do something. Microsoft Word all day. A Microsoft, Microsoft Word. Word. Now, what about Excel? Type up some documents. Maybe we can write the computer. <laughs> yeah, yeah uh, we need some. We need some spreadsheets going here. <laughs> of, of, of what? I don't know. <laughs> hey, you're the man, Saul. Thanks so much for calling in. Hey, man. You guys keep killing it, man. Thanks, Thanks for bro. taking the call. Thank you, brother. 
Peace. Look at that, man. Saul, huh? That was a good question. That was great. Yeah, that great was question. Question. That was great. You know, that's like something you should ask on the social media. Like we should do something on the story yeah. or the post. Mm-hmm. People start putting their stories. Who they're around. Oh, dude, imagine putting this. Actually, putting the faces of the Mount Rushmore. Right. Like on, somebody's gonna draw we got, this. We gotta shit. draw yeah. it, dude. Yeah. Post yeah. it, and it's gonna be like. You know, hey, what if someone did like the Mount Rushmore of the Nine Club experience? Like, there's gonna be one of us that gets dropped out. Wow, <laughs> it's, gonna, wow. it's gonna be me. It's, like, <laughs> it's fine. I'm the new guy, so I'm totally okay with that. <laughs> there you go. There you go. But uh, affirmative action. I am the only minority, so you might have to just throw me in there just just for just right. because. <laughs> right, right. But whoever whoever didn't get chosen would get so I would get so sad if I wasn't. You know? So clearly, Kelly wants to be in every one. <laughs> no, no. I mean, I'm just kidding, whatever. But. Well, I almost feel like it's like it's me, Raj, and Kelly, and it's between like Eldridge and Steezus. <laughs> yeah. And then the minority takes it. I mean, we're the. <laughs> 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 Damn it. <laughs> Took my ju- took my seat, took my right, took right. my spot on the I mean, listen, <laughs> me and Raj and I were the original nine club guys, and then we bring Kelly in, and then so now it's when we bring Eldridge in, and then Steezus. Wait, actually, oh. would it be Kelly or would it be Kelly's button? Oh, the button. Oh, maybe. I was the yeah. first guest though, too. Yeah. First Before guess. the button. Yeah, but that, no, he was, that doesn't right. make you a part of the, like... Was, was the button in Paul Hart's episode? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That button was from the very beginning. I feel yeah. like the button, it deserves a place over Kelly. I'm with the button. It's with it's me. me. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> let, let go of it. Let go of it. Now say something. What's good, dude? <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to use, trying to use steez as his mic. Uh, yeah. well, if we're adding the button, then the, the iPad has to come, too. Um, well, that's a part of me. Uh, oh. Man. That was Mark Johnson. Oh, and then there's now a Stella Farage. There's a sign. And stuff. Yeah. See, hey, fair game. We're going too far with this, yeah. bro. Yeah. <laughs> you know, just say it's me, Raj Kelly, and who and Justin. We have season. five. <laughs> we have five. You there's want five, five for us. There's five Mount Rushmore guys, dude. Yeah. It's us five. It's us we're five. all together here. Fuck yeah. Fucking carve out whoever's making this on the internet, because I know somebody will. Just carve out some extra shit for me. <laughs> <laughs> just draw me in there. <laughs> Make it well, mashed potatoes. <laughs> Well, listen, man, this has been a great show. It's been a great show. Every Talked show about is a, a lot great show. Good, you know, that's right. Talked about some good skateboarding, some good videos, some good news. I had a couple good callers. Huh? Hey, we haven't hey. done that in months. That was great. It's been I a lot of a good caller. Yeah. But, uh, and just to remind people also, Spotify. Huh? We're on Spotify now. What it's other platforms you got? Uh, we are on Google Play, Apple Podcasts, Stitcher, TuneIn, iHeartRadio, Nice. SoundCloud and of course nineclub.com you could find everything and uh, our YouTube channel and you of course, course. Yeah, of YouTube. course like and subscribe there we go Kelly Yo, thanks right. smash that like button wherever, the, wherever it is just hit it up Yo, know Roberts is too like yeah, he's, he's like, too coy to say that so I'll say subscribe smash that like button we want to get this to 10,000 likes we're trying to fucking break the algorithm you feel 10, me 10,000 no. 10,000 likes? likes oh likes right come on dog I know how this YouTube shit works <laughs> <laughs> we need to get subscribers up <laughs> yeah subscribe for real tell you to tell you, I just think it's friend. corny to say that. You know, uh, well, all the YouTubers are always like the saying the bell. shit. You Yo, know? turn the notifications on so you know when the shit goes live right at midnight. I mean, how many of these fucking people? They they have to do twenty things. <laughs> Dude, like, they have it, to like, yeah. subscribe. You're just an old grumpy dude who doesn't want to do this. The kids love it. Thank God that camera's in the way. I can't really see. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> That's why. <laughs> 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 <laughs>